Welcome everybody to Towers and Gods, episode 80. 8-0. We made it 80 episodes into this series. Let's go. How? How is Woo. that? How did we make that happen? Because uh, we were having fun and because of all of you guys. Um, I don't know. I didn't have a plan for this uh, intro to the 80th episode, <laughs> but I am happy to be here. And, I, and I'm, you know, <laughs> I'm surprised y'all are still with me. Thank, thank you to the cast. 80 episodes. Shout out. Um, I'm here joined by Isaiah, who plays Kun Jong Se. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the last episode of Towers and Gods. Um, I just want to say it's been a blast. Who who would have thought? Hey, look at us! Look at look at us, guys. Chat, look at look at us. Who who would have thought? Us here? It's crazy. Cut the camera, though. Cut the, cut to the other camera. Uh, 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 we 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 have Milios who plays Brack Bronson. Hello there. The music like faded out. I know. <laughs> Hello there. Oh man. Okay, now I have the stream up. Y'all, I know we crashed last time, so I'm trying to I'm trying something different. Oh, I'm scared. God. What do you mean? <laughs> scary scary this week. I'm like waiting for the crash to happen now. It's gonna be fine! It's gonna be fine. We have Sun Wu who plays Lopo Bia Wu. It's fitting that the last episode I'm a part of is uh, <laughs> one of oh my god little great split like <laughs> Wait, it's a card game, bro. Guys, who the thought? We've come a long way. <laughs> last episode, it's crazy. You guys rehearse this? <laughs> no. <laughs> Can I get an amen? <laughs> we... No, you can't. <laughs> no. We have <laughs> Hannah. My computer is killing, screaming at me. Who plays Ha Eden? Hello, everybody. Welcome to the stream. I'm totally going to do great with this card game on Friday the 13th. As Nefta said, you know, in card games, you know, there is no luck. It's just, you know, it's the all cards you get skill. or something like that. It's yeah. all skill. So That's I'm right. I'm totally, you know, if it was chess, I'd feel good. Card games, yeah, not so much. So we'll see how it goes. Mm, okay, okay. You're just lucky it it's not checkers, as you know. Joe oh, knows no, I play a mean checkers. <laughs> I play a mean checkers. <laughs> I wish okay, I had a Taren. camera right now. I wish I had a camera. <laughs> You're looking at an unimaginary camera. I see you. I see you. <laughs> and we have other other Joe as Damien Frog. Hello, everybody. It is me, Damien Frog, other Joe. Did you know that on the 80th episode, it is Friday the 13th, and Friday the 13th came out in 1980. Boom. Oh my Mr. gosh! So let's go. Mm. Joe Voorhees well, is, Joe. is 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 the final boss of this floor. Let's go. Dang. <laughs> Joe told me to introduce some like Smash Brothers, so I, I tried my best. I'm, I, I'll work on it for for next week. But uh, we're here. Thank you all for being here. Um, we we did have a crash last week, which brings me to my first point. If you didn't watch the part two, it is up on uh, the channel. Go check it out. It ends uh, in a very fun way, a fun little teaser for what's to come today. So go check out that part two. Um, go show it some support. Um, and uh, yeah, I had one more thing to say at the start. Here we go. Um, I'll say that in a bit, actually. First, I want Hannah. Do you have the super chats available that we could potentially? I have read most off? of them. I think. Let's go. Okay. Okay. Let me scroll down and very carefully. Because I'm trying Devlin. my best not to overload my computer. Yeah. Devlin. Devlin, thank you for the 19 months of being a member. Woo! Let's go. Shout out. And then we got Dart Angel with $10. Due to my overwhelming and hateful disgust of Eden's mother, membership roulette will encompass an opera event. Everyone will everyone will be a member in chat today. No excuses, no exceptions. What? Let's help Eden climb. Oh, shoot. Dart Angel, be financially responsible. That is always my <laughs> yes, predicate for that. Please. We got $9.99 from Master Gold. I know everyone is excited for more Eden trauma. Wow, thanks. But there is something more important. Sonic, Sonic Superstars trivia. is a brand new 2D Sonic game and comes out in less than a week for all major platforms October the 17th. How did our series turn into just like a promo for Sonic? Like, I, I, don't, I don't know how know. that happened. Mustafa demand a check. <laughs> with SAR 25 says, Eden, activate your trap card. The power of friendship. The problem is, is Eden doesn't have a lot of friends at the moment. I've never seen you, you know. she, 
she's 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 they're all in her doll they're all in her mom's dollhouse which is really creepy but you know we'll go with that all right you heard it here for <laughs> first folks friendship is a trap card <laughs> oh no the spoilers we have superior matt with 80 dollars for episode 80 and if my math what? is correct holy hitting the 350 hour mark by the time you take your break. Oh, Thank you for all the wow. time and effort you have put into bringing these characters and story to life every week. We're coming for your one piece. <laughs> oh God, it's so scary to say out loud because everyone, the what way is... everyone talks about one piece. I was actually like so ready to support it. And then I was like, no. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> <That's crazy. laughs> It is crazy. But, uh, you know, hey, we're having fun. We're, we're going to keep doing it oh, well, yeah. as long as we're having fun. And uh, w when we end, we'll have a finished story, you know, which is so ex that, that I'm, I Someday we're going to look back and be like, wow, you know, what an adventure. Uh, so thank you for the support, Matt. Yeah. And no, this isn't our last episode, gentlemen. It's, it's not. Um, yeah. We got to get Brack purification at the very least. I, I need mean, to know about Brack. Four hours is a long time. We'll see what happens. But yeah, yeah, yeah. I, Isaiah. We just can't mm -hmm. be sure. We just can't be You'll sure. You'll never in the, know. In the trying times, you know? Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. Brack going down door in the car, Dan. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Dang. That's where he goes. If you think about it. <laughs> if the series ends now, we'll get a movie. If you think about it. Oh, that's Joe, true. Joe, 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 Joe. Hold right, Joe. At least one movie, Joe. maybe two movies. <laughs> yeah. oh, Are the movies right. canon, we got, though? We gotta die. We gotta uh, die today, bro. It's gotta happen. No, gotta that stop. Deal, all right, what else? All right, so we have Franta with a thousand CZK. Hello oh, wow. and happy to report I'm finally caught up on all the episodes and watched the latest one. And Eden's mom is relatively pretty, but a horrible personality for Eden. <laughs> I yep. love the relatively, like, you know, relatively she's, pretty, she's, but. Uh, she's decent, I yeah, guess. Yeah, yeah. Um, six. King Kenobi so with 10. <laughs> Want to give a shout out to Milios, Hannah, and Mon for helping with my fan project. Really appreciate it. Hopefully yes! I have something to share with That soon. song was fire. King Kenobi, I got your message. I've been too busy. I listened though. You're insane. We're going to talk. We're going to chat. <gasps> We're going to chat. Uh, yes, I, I got to send him my stuff today. I said I was going to do it last yeah. week and I was, I got too busy and he reminded me today and I got you. I I, I almost have the third one picked out. So, Joe, if possible, mm -hmm. can that Brax song he made be used on Brax purification? Yeah, we'll talk. I, you know, yeah. we'll, we'll talk. We'll talk. I, that is definitely a strong possibility. Um, any, it, anything maybe else? It's, maybe it's, you know, the, oh, we got more. We got more. We have more. Holy. Maybe we this got is the last more. Episode. Captain Save a Hobo member for 17 months. Hell Good yeah. to have you back. Welcome back. Uh, Matt87 Eagle with 499. Happy to celebrate my birthday with all of my oh. TNG brothers. Happy tonight. birthday. Oh, happy birthday. Happy Let's birthday. go. Happy birthday, Since, brother. Shout Since out. Please. Since it's Friday no the turn. Since it's Friday the 13th, what's everyone's favorite Jason movie? Matt, I hate to break it to you. I haven't seen a single one, so I can't help you, but maybe the boys can. The original. Can. Okay, we got an original. I, I, Wait, it's what? The, what I franchise? Have, the Friday the 13th. Friday the 13th. Yeah. yeah, the original is the best one. Original? Two originals? I, I've seen one Friday the 13th movie. I don't think it counts, but Freddy versus Jason. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> kind of goes hard. It doesn't count, bro. It does. It does. Let it count. It's so good. There are your answers, good. Matt. I hope they suffice. <laughs> uh, we got Frant as a member for 15 months. Thank you for rejoining. King Kenobi, a member for five months. Thank you for re-upping your membership. Thank you. Oh, uh, hold on. No, it skipped. It skipped. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, Matt, with another four ninety nine every oh year, God. I go to Cheesecake Factory with the fam. Got Reese's nice. Cheesecake waiting for me. Yum. That sounds delicious. I am nice. I am a Linda's Fudge fudge Cake like girl, so I understand delicious. the Reese's. It's so good. Matt the third with 10 Star Wars trivia. Oh, oh no. 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 Oh, my buzzer. You know it. You love it, and it's here <laughs> once again. Oh Tossed you a bone, haha. <laughs> Last week, Joe threw the pause, though the pause was a concern. So, a hard one this week. Who is the First Order's supreme leader? What is the First Order? Correct answer. He gets an A+. Plus. No, don't you roll your eyes. Joe is correct. He has been unsullied by the sequels. He's 
I give him a pass on that wait, one. Wait, wait, this is a sequel question? Crazy. Yes. No, but it's not the correct <laughs> answer. No, you ain't telling me, my guy. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. He's <laughs> running back crazy, but he doesn't know the answer. I give him, I give him a pass. I give him a Wait, for, okay, if this is the sequels, I have an answer. I have an answer. I have an answer. You ain't been on the internet. Hold on, hold on, hold on. If this is sequel content, if this is a sequel content, I have an answer. It's, um... Don't say uh, I have it. Snoke? You get half a half. Is it uh, just yeah, yeah, Snoke? You get, you get half for lying to everybody. Because that, yeah. that's crazy. Because that's actually crazy. I know that's a character that like was a big deal and then wasn't a big deal. You're right so, and you're wrong at the same time because okay. it's him, it to him, but I'm going to give it to him. Yeah, that, I'm, I'm going to say, uh, uh, say on a moral that's note. <laughs> That's you that shouldn't do right. that to people. I should, crazy. That's I, should, I think yeah, Hannah's disappointed in me once again. Yeah. Hannah was so happy that's with right. my first answer. Uh, I look. I would like to poison my answer. Your, oh, I, uh, I, I like his answer. I'll, like Albus that. Dumbledore. <laughs> I think that. Uh, uh, I think that's later on. <laughs> Yeah, that's yeah, that's that's, that's later on. You have, you have to, you have to wait. How are we talking? <laughs> way later. You have to wait till Gandalf shows up with some eagles. Yeah, it's right. the third Lord of the Rings movie. <laughs> no, it's in the seventh and a half movie. Don't sully. Part, part three. Hey, wait, we gotta um, move up. <laughs> yes, Crisis with ten dollars. Yo, first time donating here. Crisis. Thank you, Crisis. Love you. Also, remember to always trust in the heart of the cards. Yeah, I just I trust in my We're chess openings fine. and tactics a little bit more, but we'll we'll go with it. Heart of the cards, let's go, baby! Listen, right, that's it. listen, card games are just like it's like chess except random. So no, you should no, be you fine. Gotta believe, your, you have to believe in your deck, bro. Like <laughs> yeah. the cards speak to you, bro. <laughs> No. <laughs> <It's not. laughs> what is wrong with you? All right. Well, thank you. <laughs> I'm imagining chess grandmaster Magnus Carlson being like, "Well, I'm good at chess, so I have to be good at Yu-Gi-Oh." Come on. <laughs> yeah. They go hand in hand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like they, they go hand in hand. hand. You play chess, I play Yu-Gi-Oh. We're the same. <laughs> okay. All right, all right. All right. So, so thank you all so much for donating. Thank you. Uh, if you want to join in the discussion of the series, you want to talk about the series, you want to create memes and fan art, Discord's down below. Don't forget to leave a like on this stream. And we're going to go ahead and get started. I'm going to say uh, all the cast should be in roll 20, um, pretty much for all of today. Roll 20. We're going to be relying on roll 20 quite a bit today, um, for better or worse. Oh boy. So keep that in mind. Um, I'll be using it as a medium to show things as well. Uh, so that is why I'm saying that. But you'll also see it on my screen too. Uh, other Matt thing, thing. Uh -huh. Matt, Matt the Third, ready to watch Eden Yeet Nefta into the Shadow oh. Realm. Also, TNG card game win. I want living. I want a living bomb people with the SS Damien card. <laughs> Thank you, Matt. <laughs> Can, uh, you know what's crazy? There's not a living bomb card. I'll spoil it. Red. I'll spoil it. Yeah, maybe in the expansion. That's, maybe no, in the DLC. Yeah, I'll say it's a DLC. Yeah, DLC, yeah, yeah, DLC. yeah, 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 yeah. There's also yeah, yeah. They gotta okay. pay well, to win for those heavy <laughs> yeah, cards. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> But um, on a more serious note, uh, while we're getting into this episode, uh, the series is 18 plus. Uh, we deal with some heavy topics here. So trigger warning regarding uh, certain heavy 18 plus topics. You've been warned. Um, but uh, okay. That being said, we're going to begin. So brief recap. Last time you all entered the world of Eden's purification. Most of Team Recall inside of a dollhouse uh, while Eden herself was in a room where she could flip a switch between her father Sigmund and her mother Nefta. Um, by the end of it, Nefta and Eden uh, got into a confrontation where uh, Nefta challenged Eden to a card game uh, and uh, Eden accepted. And uh, apparently these cards may have some significance to to uh, Eden and to the rest of the team. Meanwhile, the team is exploring this dollhouse in their miniature forms, discovering paintings that represent Eden's life, puzzles that give grab bags, etc. So, uh, yeah, with that being said, I think we're going to go ahead and get started. Um, I want to begin with Eden, but this is going to very quickly tie in the rest of the team. So, Eden, okay. you are... Mm -hmm. In the room with Nefta, Nefta has just challenged you to this card game, and you notice that she's she's holding these cards, and you can see specifically that on these cards are the faces and names of people you know quite well, including yourself. You see Eden, Jong, Damien, and they, they kind of, she kind of like opens up the hand and then closes it once again. And on the back of the card, you see total value recall. And she starts to shuffle 
the cards in her hand and just and she looks up at you smirking and smiling you've never been good at card games but allow me to give you a hint some advice This is not like other card games you may be familiar with. A card game such as this relies heavily upon the concept of deck building. And she smiles and smirks. But with how incompetent of a daughter you are and how incompetent of a friend you must be to your team, that will not be your job today. And she looks towards the dollhouse. Your teammates will be drafting your deck. If they draft you terrible cards, well, you'll have to play with the hand you're dealt. Conversely, they could acquire powerful cards for you to use in our duel. But even then, you have to have the wisdom to know how to use them. Allow me to explain the rules. And she smokes from her pipe. Unless you have a question, dear daughter. Why would I ever question you, mother? Correct answer. Now, <clears throat> everybody within the dollhouse, what is about to be explained and talked about is suddenly also being seen slash heard by you. So what I mean by that is most of you still have your pockets and such. So... While Nefta explains these rules, your pockets all pop up. And some of you are in front of the painting. I know a lot of you are within that clock room. It doesn't matter. All of you, your pockets pop up. And you start to see visuals and words that explain these rules. Now, you don't have the full context, obviously. But these rules are being explained. And uh, I'm going to do my best to explain this. Um, I will also say <laughs> that... There is going to be a document that contains the quote-unquote rule book. So if you want to go into more detail regarding any of these uh, things that I mentioned, that will be available to the cast. And uh, I'll also put it for the, for the people watching. Join the Discord. I'll put it in the Discord as well. But uh, give me just one moment here while I pull that up. This may be a bit shaky, but I'm going to do my best. Oh, you're good. I was just, I was fixing to scribble like crazy, but I'm glad <laughs> you have a document so I don't have to do it. I do have a document. Yay! I'll explain some things first and then I'll share the document with everybody. Uh, let me find some music here. Give me a sec. Let's do this. I'm going to move everyone on roll 20 to a seemingly blank page where I'm going to be displaying some cards. And that way you can have a visual reference for what I'm talking about. Oh boy. About. So Nefta begins to explain the rules. The primary objective of total value recall is to collect more value than your opponent. And there's kind of like this robotic voice that's being heard by most people who are listening to these rules. This voice is, you know, explaining everything that's going on. Over the 10 rounds of gameplay present, whichever player has the most value at the end wins. There are four types of cards that you may play in Total Value Recall. So I'll show this here and make sure that this has the right thing selected. There we go. So I can demonstrate here. Okay. The first type of card that you may play is a character card. And a card pops up on your screen to kind of demonstrate what this might mean. <laughs> Two of them. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Give me a sec. <laughs> Wait, hold, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Bulwark is like ruining my roll 20. What's going on? Why is Bulwark, why is Bulwark the only one doing that? Other Joe, your the name, goat, sir. The goat is here. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Why is that happening? Give me a sec. Give me a sec. I don't know why that'd be, ha why that's happening. Uh, give me a moment. Um, is that how it is for everything? You 
thought you could contain bulwark in a card. <laughs> I guess I guess not. <laughs> He's supposed to be played in like a certain uh, ratio, but the ratio is kind of goofing. Do you think this man waxes his bald head to be contained? Oh my gosh. There we go, there we go. The texture and the shine is immaculate. Like, you're not keeping that. <laughs> the shine button, will be though. unleashed upon the battlefield. <laughs> <laughs> Pardon me, the playing field. Thank you, thank you. Okay, I think I've got it fixed. It'll just be a little bit of a annoyance, but that's okay. Maybe I can fix it later. So I once again, Mr. Clay <laughs> so much. Gosh dang it, chat. All right. So once again, right on track. the objective is to collect the most value by the end of your opponent at the end of the game. The first type of card you may play in Total Value Recall is a character card. Character cards allow you to attack and block your opponent's character cards, and each of them also features a value stat in the upper right corner of the card. At the end of each round, you'll tally up all of your character's value, and that'll be added to your total value. So by the end of the 10 rounds, whichever player has the most value earned from their characters wins. There is an alternative way to win, which is to decrease your opponent's value to zero. You start the game with 20. By the end of the 10 rounds, whoever has more value wins, or whoever brings their opponent's value down to zero wins. The stat on the bottom left is called Fight. The stat on the bottom right is HP. Fight is how much damage you deal to other characters, and when your HP is brought to zero, the card must be discarded. Character cards cost gold to play. Thank you, Bulwark. You've done well. Those are character cards. There is another type of card in this game known as an action card. Let me pull one up here. Uh, there we go. Mm -hmm. Okay. Action cards may be played using Shinsu, which is another resource. And when played, mm. they immediately take effect before being discarded. So in this case, if you spend two Shinsu to play Deadly Lightning, you may deal two damage before discarding the card. However, there are two types of action cards. Sudden actions, as you see here, and what are known as basic actions. That aspect ratio is annoying me, but it is perfectly okay. Basic actions are cards that can are cards that can only be played on your turn and take up an action to use. Sudden actions may be played during your opponent's turn, during your own turn, at any time and do not require an action. They both require Shinsu to use. There is another type of card in this game known as an item card. <laughs> there we go. Item cards are spent using Suspendium. There are only three types of resources in this game. Gold for characters, Shinsu for action cards, Suspendium for both action cards, or for item cards and location cards. Item cards can be equipped to characters to give them permanent benefits. The advantage to having an item card is even if the equipped character is killed or discarded, the item remains on the field to be equipped by another character, if you so wish, to be played into that slot, which we'll talk about in a minute. So items are permanent. The last type of card in this game is known as a location card. Every character card in this game has a faction or multiple factions. You may have noticed that Bulwark had the Stexa faction. So a location card benef allows benefits to these factions. For example, with for six suspendium, you could play this location card. And it is a permanent effect throughout the rest of the game for your zone of cards. Are there any questions so far? <laughs> this first part is gonna be explaining rules. Bear with us, people. 
going once. We can all ask questions, right? Yeah, sure. Go ahead. Yeah, okay. Uh, so, how, like, is there, like, a total of, like, value and, like, gold and Shinsu and, and Suspendium that we, we have at the start? Like, does that get increased? Ah, you're wondering how to collect resources. Yeah. So, you do not start with resources. If you go second, you do, but uh, we'll go into that right now. Very good uh, segue, Damien Frog. I can see you're no stranger to card games, but that's no surprise. Okay. <laughs> We're going to the other screen here. Okay. So the question regards regarding resources. Okay, let me pull this up. <clears throat> Throughout the game, dice will be rolled to determine resources for the round. Whoever has the higher value light bearer chooses resources first. There's going to be a set of dice rolled, and that's the first set, and another set of dice rolled, each with three dice. The light bearer chooses which set they wish to take for the round, and then the second player is forced to take the other set of dice. Each dice contains gold, shinsu, suspendium, or drawing cards on the faces of the six-sided dice. Also, once you claim the dice, you may re-roll any of them a single time. So if you wish to take it, re-roll one die, you absolutely can. That is how you collect resources. Resources last throughout the game, not just the round. So if you wish to save up resources throughout the 10 rounds, you may do so. Mm. I see. It's a round based. 10 rounds, indeed. So say when a card say i destroy your bulwark card is uh -huh. that gone is that gone permanently for for all the rounds it is hmm it is indeed what about if you what about if you win a round does that mean your cards are gone permanently as well did like are they like moved off or round well, eh, rounds are not one per se however you're trying to defeat the opponent's characters while making your own characters survive that way you collect value off of your cards while they do not collect value off of their cards at the end of each turn. Mm -hmm. I will say that some cards are worth zero value. And their purpose Rift is and... more in their stats rather than their value total. <laughs> Listen, Dan's a good card. <laughs> Dan owns Bulwark, holy. <laughs> <laughs> but that's true. I, I never thought about that. <laughs> it's a big counter. Damn. <clears throat> okay. Now, one last rule on resources. Throughout the game, the resource values increase. So, for example, during the first couple of rounds, if the die lands upon a gold, you only gain one gold from that die. However, as the game progresses, that gold represents two gold, and then at the very end of the game, it represents three. So the farther the game goes along, each side of the dice represents more of that resource. So let's say you roll a gold, a shinsu, and a suspendium. At first, that's only worth one of each. But near the end of the game, you would get three of each if that is what you roll. Uh, mm. Kind of interrupting the rule explanation, uh, Nefta takes this opportunity to look at you, Eden. Too many rules? Well, Mother, considering you made them up, there's always going to be too many rules. I'm simply creating a game that will test your limits. I suppose this is as good a time as any to introduce your card. Shouldn't that one be discarded since it's so defective and broken? You're on the right track. You're so close. You're so close. You see... I want you... And she slides the card on over to you to start with this card. You don't have to use it in the final game. But I would love it. If you could... Hold on, give me a sec to upload it. I realized it was the only one that I didn't have because I changed it at the last minute. <laughs> oh my gosh. 
You're not forced to use this card. In fact, I wouldn't blame you if you didn't. You see, the person explaining these rules explained that certain cards had certain benefits while others did not. Is it any surprise that your card is worth zero value? And she just smirks. In fact, I think I'm giving you too much credit. And when she says that, it's almost as if you can't tell if Nefta is the one creating this game or if this game is possibly being created by you, Eden, by your own mm. inner thoughts and feelings about these people that you've met on your journey. And she slides this card over to you as if to say she'll let you start with this one and the rest of your friends can build a deck around it if they wish. The rules continue. The first phase of the game... Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Um, is there... Is there a way to... I don't know, were you just about to go into, like, value? A little bit. But what's your okay, question? Then, no, well, I want to see if you answer it. You can go ahead. Okay. The first phase of the game is known as the resource phase, which is exactly as I described. Rolling the dice, whoever has the higher value light bearer, chooses their set of dice before the other. And that's it. You collect your resources before entering the second phase of the game, which is known as the action phase. Players will begin taking turns, taking actions. And actions can be one of three things. Playing a card, attacking, or resting a card if it, if it applies. Resting a card essentially means using up, and you will tip it on its side. I'll demonstrate here. I actually have a display that may uh, be a bit helpful here. There we go. Hopefully you all can see this. Okay. Each card has a position, which also means that you cannot have three or four fishermen on your side of the field. A team having multiple fishermen wouldn't be of any use anyway, right? Let's use our friend Bo- Oh wow, so, dude, okay, there we go. Now it's being played in the proper resolution. In this example, Bulwark is your team's fisherman. He is played into the fisherman slot, which is why if you were to play an item into the fisherman slot, it remains in that slot for the remainder of the game for any future fisherman to use as they please. You have a slot for fisherman, scout, wave controller, light bearer, and spear bearer. You can determine these cards based on the symbol above their faction and the color of the card. So all fishermen are blue. All wave control, or sorry, God. <laughs> I said blue and he's yellow. I was gonna say, I was Don't like, Do worry you about get it. some of those color Don't glasses? worry about it. <laughs> I called uh, the dragon fire colored, uh, right? <laughs> Did also I say? True. So also don't true. don't worry about it. <laughs> Wave controllers are blue. Light bearers are purple. Why? Why would you put him out? Why? We know we're throwing that card away <laughs> as soon as it hits our table. Like shoot. Spear bearers. Are orange. So you know you're not <gasps> supposed to leave the Joker card in the deck, My right? baby! <laughs> and, last, thanks, thanks, that's it. and lastly, scouts are green. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> so oh, is, no. It, is there a problem? <laughs> I kind of think there's a problem. <laughs> what a cast of characters. <laughs> oh, <clears throat> now you may have noticed that there is a slot known as the free slot. This slot may be filled by a second character of a given position, but only one. So for example, if Jong fills this position, that is it. You have two wave controllers, but you could not have another scout or another wave controller or another spear bear, etc. So theoretically, these are the maximum amount of character cards you could have on the screen. 
Look at Jong with his lightning pill, little cheeky mark. That's so cool. Nefta smiles. Sorry, I have to use this. That was sentence. above table. That was not eating. <laughs> I again. know, but but table. she does smile. Brings back memories. Perhaps I'm misremembering, but were you not supposed to marry a coon? Correct me if I'm wrong. Well, Mother, you would know more about that than I would. Considering I rebelled against it. Also, you could marry a defective member of another great family. Not we as defective. Princess, not you. She, like, looks at you seriously. The only good thing you've ever done in your life. Yes, Mother, I know. But maybe, you know, Farlin and I were both kind of rejects of our family, and we still produced more power than you could ever imagine. More maybe power there is than some I could use. ever imagine. Yep. Shh, and she holds a finger up to her lips. The rules continue, and she points at the pocket. Yo, Joe, real quick. Can you like send me that card on me? Kind of <laughs> I'll, I'll, yeah, yeah. All the cards will be available after uh, this is. I didn't ask. Card. I don't want all the cards. <laughs> well, I'll send you the wow. bow card first, yeah. and then. Uh, we'll, I mean, I'll take we'll the deck, there. but I'm just saying, like, as a souvenir for you know, for playing, for showing up. I see, I see, I see. You may have noticed that there is also a Shinwei slot. This slot is rarely filled, but let's give an example of how it could be filled. Some character cards have summon effects. If we use Damien as an example, his card text says that when played, he summons Hreisvelger. In this example, Hreisvelger would be summoned to the Shinwei slot. But Hreisvelger would be able to be attacked as normal. Of course, Race is gold plus one. This little dude with his grubby little mitts, he's like, yoink. <laughs> <clears throat> one final rule about character layout that is, oh, there's only one slot for location card as well. One final rule about character placement. If you wish to play a card onto another card to replace them, so in this example, we replace Laura with Abaddon. Oh, here we go. So in this example, if you were to play Abaddon onto the Laura card, you would discard Laura, but this is an action known as withdrawing. When you withdraw a card, you do place it into the discard pile. However, you immediately gain the value of the character withdrawing. So in this example, you place Abaddon onto the field, discard Laura, and gain one value from Laura. This is withdrawing. If the character were to die in combat, you would not gain their value before they die. Okay, give me one second. So as I said, the action phase, you may play a card. And if you play that card, it then goes to the other player and they may take an action. And once they do, it goes back to your turn. Back and forth, back and forth. Play a card, attack, or rest a character if their character card says they may. To rest a card, you simply tilt the card to show that it has been used. A character rests to attack. So characters, under normal circumstances, can only attack once. There are some exceptions, as you can see with Jong's card. We're through a majority of the rules. The last thing about the placement and action phase is that similarly, the highest value light bearer decides which resources to grab first, but the highest value scout is who, who, who takes the action first. Whoever owns the highest value scout, they take the action first. And they may play cards or attack uh, before the other player, and then it'll go to the other player. The third phase of the game, once both players are done taking actions and both of them have passed, is the recalling phase. During the recalling phase, 
You take a look at all of your cards, and you tally up their value and add it to your value total. So in this example, 2, 4, 5, 7, 11, 15 value is earned in this round if you have all of these characters on the field, so you add 15 to your total value. The opponent does the same to their character cards. Once that is done, you unrest all of your characters, and the next resource phase begins in the next round. Each of the 10 rounds takes place like this, until at the end of round 10, you count up everyone's value, both players' value, and whoever has the higher value wins. The only thing left to explain is combat. Is there any questions before we get into combat? Excellent. I guess we're good. Yeah. I, I yeah. Okay. Then we combat. Let's talk about combat. So combat is quite simple in Total Value Recall. I will, uh, <laughs> I'll summon a character card as an example. We said Dan was the counter to, to Bulwark, so we'll use these two as the example. Let's assume you wish to attack with Bulwark. If you wish to attack with Bulwark, you have to rest him and then declare which character you are attacking. If there are no character cards, you deal direct damage to the opponent's value and their value decreases. However, if there is even but one character card, you must target a character. So in this example, Bulwark wishes to attack Dan. It is now the opposing player's decision. You may block with the character being attacked, or you may, pa you may disengage. Disengaging means they do not block, and you take the damage instead to your value. So, in this example, the player may block with Dan, damage is traded between the two cards. Or they may disengage, and the opposing player takes two damage instead. One final rule about disengaging. Let's say that this time, Dan is the one attacking Bulwark. In this example, Dan attacks Bulwark. If Bulwark chooses to disengage and allow you to take that damage, Bulwark loses one value. Every time a character disengages, they cowardly decide not to fight, they permanently lose a value. So at the end of every round, they're generating one less value for you if they do not choose to block. So if it's Abaddon and Abaddon chooses not to block, Abaddon's value for the rest of the game is now 1. If Jong disengages twice throughout the game, his value is now 0. Value cannot fall below 0 in this way. And that's essentially combat. Now, there are special abilities that some of these cards have, but I will let you look at what these special abilities do in the rulebook, and once you acquire cards, we may discuss them when you acquire those cards. There are a couple of extra small rules, but I'll leave them to the rulebook. Any questions? Yeah, so are there ways to Okay, okay. So first off, are there ways to, like, revive cards that have been put in the discard pile? And I guess either put them back in your hand or deck? There are indeed. Okay, and if you do, so let's say, let's say Dan attacks Bulwark, like mm -hmm. you said in your example, but Bulwark disengages, so, you know, let so uh, Eden, in this instance, would lose that value directly and then bulwark as a card loses his value exactly if he goes to the discard pile but comes back does he come back with zero value or does he come back with his original value isaiah you are asking all the right questions i've never thought of that <laughs> my answer is that his value will be reset back to what it was okay. before back to, yeah it, back okay. to the, gotcha, gotcha. back to base yeah okay same goes right. for if he had been like buffed 
by like an effect. Right, right, right. He would so go back to base. base. Right, because they're all re okay. So it resets yeah. the original. Uh, okay, gotcha, yes, gotcha, but gotcha. there are some effects that let you bring cards back from the discard pile. However, mm -hmm. you may also, if you wish, have some. You can have duplicates in your deck. So one other rule that I will say that I didn't mention: you start the game with four cards. Hand limit is eight, um, and you can only have fifty cards in the deck, which is a lot. I know. Okay. Oh, you're saying you can have duplicate. You could have like cards. two bulwarks in your deck if you wish. Okay. So okay. even if he died, okay. you could play another bulwark if you so. Right, wish. right, right. Okay. Okay. Cool. Cool. Now I did. There oh, is got that many bulwarks. <laughs> you could have a whole <laughs> deck of bulwarks. You know, could we do like a trading system before we play. You know, where we got cards we don't want. Maybe. Oh uh, man, am I playing just a zoo bulwark deck? Oh, <laughs> a zoo bulwark. Zoo, zoo bulwark. Oh my god, this game is too meta. It's a meta deck. <laughs> they need a nerf bulwark stat. <laughs> there is one other thing I will mention uh, that I that. <laughs> Amy t kindly messaged me and reminded me of. Uh, I mentioned how scouts, higher value scout, that player takes the first action in every round. Higher value light bearer, you're the first one to pick resources each round. Wave controller is what breaks ties. So if neither player has a scout, or if neither player has a light bearer, you go to whoever has the higher value wave controller. And that's what breaks the tie. Now, you may be wondering, what does Fisherman and Scout do? Do Fisherman and Scout have any special abilities? They do. And this is a bit of a weird one, and you can further look up what these things do. You may have noticed that some cards had taglines such as Provoke. Well, all Fishermen have Provoke, even if it's not listed on the card. All Fishermen have Provoke. What Provoke means, I'll just say it briefly, is they can choose to block for another character. They have something similar to Taunt from other games. They may choose to block for another character that's being attacked. All Spear Bearers have Ranged, which some cards also have that aren't Spear Bearers. That means that when attacking, they do not receive damage back, unless the opposing character is also Ranged. So Spear Bearers do not trade damage when attacking. They just deal damage. However, there's a bunch of little rules like that that will be in the rule book. I've posted the rule book. Oh, you need access? Whoopsie! Yes, please. I got you. I'm not sure if it'll be a different link. Um, it'll be a different link. It'll be a forward right. slash sharing. Then I will delete that one and post that one. For people who are in the Discord I server, see. I am now going to post the full rule book in the Towers and Gods channel. I'll also pin it if you wish to read more. But we'll bring up some of these other extra details throughout the game. I'm very glad I didn't explain all of that in the Nefta voice. I'm very, we, that would have been a little bit difficult. Okay, are there any questions about the rules of the game? Dude, there's so many cards, 99 character cards, 18 item cards. 50 Holy. action cards. There are 99 character cards. 50 it's very action likely, cards. Drew, it is very likely, everyone, that we are not going to see a certain character in this <laughs> in, in the battle. Yeah. Oh, so this this finna be like the whole episode. I got you. Okay. We're not finding every card. And this is where you all come into play. For all of you lovely people in the dollhouse, you'll be presented with some options, some choices, and depending on which options you take in the dollhouse, you'll be presented with other cards to earn. Now, I will say this too. Um, you have a time limit. And that time limit is just when basically the, the episode today. So by the end of today's episode, you will have essentially earned all the cards that will be used in Eden's deck. Cool. Wow. No pressure, gentlemen. I think Eden wants a bunch of bulwarks, so make sure you. No, I'm good. Hats off to all you. Bulwark actually might be a meta deck. Oh, the Joe relax. Kind of good, relax. right? <laughs> relax all right. I'll just look. Look, uh, if other so, Joe, if you can I'm figure muted. out the meta I... that quickly, go for it. Oh, I had something. Oh yeah. I was just saying, you got to give that some substance, like time wise, because like that's a very nondescript amount of time that I I, I understand that I was being a little bit meta there um I'm gonna say yeah. like 
at you know three hours you know you'll essentially but in, in, in that's in game time right three hours of in game time sure i i I'm, i'll say three hours in game time yeah okay that that works fine and that may or may not also be out of game time depending on today's episode what um, you're saying to assemble the deck um or right so like, so to clarify yeah. um yeah. you all are drafting the cards eden will build the deck from the cards you've given her from the cards that we obtain okay that's right her. what i'm saying is yes right. so, but we have three hours to pick which uh-huh. cards we're drafting yep. yes okay. Okay. well not okay. pick but obtain obtain that's the that is that is the yeah. key word there obtain um and knowing these rules are essential to figure out what cards that we got to get for her anyway um. well yeah yeah Help me, Team Recall. You are my only hope. <laughs> oh, shit, bro. I would have been left Tatooine, I'm just saying. Yeah, I ain't no Obi-Wan, but I give him my best shot. That's all we can ask for. People are already creating metas in the chat with just they the cards really we've are. seen. I'm sure. That, I'm sure. <clears throat> I want to. I mean, okay. the, the the meta Bulwark deck doesn't <laughs> Actually, work. Shoot, Joe, I'm gonna need you to relax with this. <laughs> you could only have two team. max bulwarks on the field. You can only have, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. That's true. Also, you Wait, cannot you have more that? than three cards in a deck. Uh, three duplicates is the limit. I'm sorry, Joe. Yeah, that, that's that tracks. Yeah. What were you saying, Isaiah? Um. So you said, so scouts, uh, their value determines the. Uh, like who goes first in the action? Like who takes the first the action? First. Yep. Um, light bearer is resources. So yep. Who gets to pick resources? And wave controller is a tiebreaker. Yes, for both of them. Con- for both what light if, bearer and scout. What if wave controllers? Like what if they are the same? I have it in the rule book. I think. Oh, I, okay. Okay. I, just, I, I, didn't, um, I didn't read the whole thing. I just. I think at like, that you know. point, it's it's gonna be a dice roll. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Gotcha, gotcha. It's just a dice roll. So even if you had a a one value scout and your opponent didn't have a scout, you're you're going first every time, you know. Right. Yeah. 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 I got gotcha, you. Yeah. I got gotcha. you. Okay. So the rules are finished explaining. The pockets kind of disappear, and uh, Nefta gets up from her chair and walks, and you can hear the click click across the floor and she walks over to the dollhouse and she looks back to you Eden do you trust your teammates no mother Mm. and it appears that you'll be relying Perhaps on pure luck after all. Your deck will be drafted from the cards you find. But mine, and she flips her cards in her hand, will be as I please. One more thing. Rules for thee, but not for me, right, mother? And one more thing. And uh, around this time, uh, Damien, your group was, you, you finished seeing the vision in the painting, and then you would also, you stepped out of the painting, acquired the shard, and you'd, um, you, you'd seen these rules. <laughs> There's like a loud click that you hear, Damien, and one of the walls swings open next to you. Just like the whole wall swings open. And like this giant hand comes towards you. What do you do? Uh, the, the, the no, stop, hand, no. <laughs> All right. We talk before we touch. No, 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 no. Oh no, no. I'm okay. I'm taking a step back. I'm really, see, guys, guys. I don't want. I don't want this. Whatever this is. The giant hand is is about to grab the back of your shirt. What? What? Hey! Do you watch? Do you attempt to do anything? 
<laughs> I'm just slowly, wa- I'm just slowly <laughs> walking away. I'm like, guys. All right. Guys. Hugo and Hans and Duke are just like, are, their eyes are wide, like stepping away from the hand. This hand is like the size of the room. Like it's, it's barely even fitting through the wall. And it grabs you by the back of your shirt. Hey, hey, <laughs> put me down. Hey! <laughs> what What are you doing? Pulls you out of the room. And uh, Eden, after Nefta pulls her hand back from the dollhouse, and you can see this tiny, tiny Damien being dangled by her hand. And she's just staring at Damien. Damien, what are you, are you like thrashing or? Do I, do I have a squeaky Yes, voice? I was just going to say that you definitely do have a squeaky voice. <laughs> <laughs> hey, put me down. Oh, yep, yeah, put me down. I don't want to be food. No, please. What's going on? Even in on? this tense situation, like, Eden still is just like, <sighs> like, trying to keep herself composed because the sight is funny, the voice is funny. Damien tends to always crack her up, but she's I'm just gonna, like, I'm oh going to blow God. you up. <laughs> She'll flinch at that. She'll flinch at the blowing up thing. This one's rather feisty. And she holds it right up to her face. And you just see this giant staring at you, Damien. Why, what big red eyes you have. (laughs) There's one more thing to keep in mind, Eden. These teammates that you care so little about and that mean nothing to you, they're intrinsically tied to this game. And then she stares at Damien. And I do not tolerate cheating. Is that clear? She looks to you, Eden. You have a very twisted perception on what I just said, Mother. They do mean a lot to me. And yet you don't trust them. Is such a thing possible? Just like you meant a lot to me, Mother, and I still trusted you. (laughs) And then, so her other hand is kind of like still resting on the desk and her fingers are like up against the windows of the dollhouse. And she, her eyebrows like go up for a second. And she looks down at where her hand is. And you just hear... And you see that Hans has his needle like under her fingernail. And he's like jamming it. He's trying to jam it. I'll I'll save you, Damien! (laughs) Oh, crap. You're freaking awesome, Hans. Oh my gosh. Another bromance is going to start from this. (laughs) And uh, Hugo, Hugo like runs up to try to get him to back away. And he, and, but then, but Nefta just like examines the needle stuck in her finger. Hmm. And yet they'd go this far. And she plucks it and she puts her hand back down to where they are. And Hans is still like kind of struggling. And then she just flicks Hans and he goes crashing through the wall. And you all don't see where he went. He just goes. Oh, no. He just gets sent through the walls. Rip, dude. Oh, if you notice, Mother, he was coming to save Damien, not me. Oh, that is absolutely true. I'm glad you noticed. And then she takes Damien and... Eden! Believe in the heart of cards! I believe in you, you can do it! (sighs) Just ask yourself... What would a race smoker do? A A little twitch of a grin, and she's just like, oh man. And she. she... The tone of my voice does not express how absolutely terrified I am. (laughs) I think it does. And she ever so gently, Damien, places you back in the piano room and gently closes the wall back to where it was. Now then, Eden, unless you have something else you wish to ask me, I believe you should be busy prepping. Wow. And she looks down. Prepping, and looks at your one card. Prepping to the best of your ability. 
Remember our deal. Three hours. Yes, mother. Good girl. And it's, it's like something you've never heard in your life. You've never heard her say. Yeah, like Eden, like, looks like she 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 doesn't really she, like she looks very shocked like when she says that like what now run along is this why did you say that she smiles wide you like it i'll have to incorporate it into my speech more You know, just like shake her head of like, no, this you're imagining things, and she'll take the card and then flip the switch. Okay, we'll cut back to that in just a moment. Jong's group, you had just gotten done listening to these rules, and you'd heard a bit of commotion. These walls are are not exactly you know thick. Um, you heard some of the commotion. But aside from that, you didn't get to see uh, what had happened uh, to your other teammates, at least not at the moment. Did the master hand take the Pillsbury Doughboy? You, <laughs> I don't think you would have seen that unless you. We could say that you exited the clock room because then you would have seen that. No, no, I'm saying because you you said that uh, we heard. And so I'm pretty oh, sure maybe right, right. yeah. I see. What you're wouldn't wouldn't you guys hear it as the normal voice though? I don't know. <laughs> you would hear, you would hear a normal voice for sure, but <laughs> Brack's like on another area. Brack <laughs> <Brad, laughs> operates on another playing field, so I don't know. So this entire test is all going to boil down to a game of cards and chance. She shakes her head. You notice Lonnie looks deep in thought. She's kind of like hand on her chin thinking. If you're reading the rule book, I got you. I got you. <laughs> read up, girl, read up. Well, well, this is kind of exciting. Better than uh, the, the, well, you know, it's not better than the theater performance that Damien's trial entailed. However, I do like the fact that we're not losing limbs and disappearing. That's rather nice. Yet. Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Uh, Brack, Jong, Wu, what do you think of this card game? Whatever red leader's going through, she'll come out on top. It's not that simple. Not by herself, she won't. Sounds like we're going to have to put together a pretty good deck. So, let's get to work. Was we were going to say Sorry. something? Uh, no, I, I'm good. I said what I had to say. Do any of you know if Eden is good at carts? It's not something I would assume, but she could surprise us. So it doesn't really matter whether she's good at card games, because this is clearly a little bit more than just your typical card game. What My job is to make sure she wins. And what matters is she's good under pressure, right? She'll get the job done. That's true. She'll need some OP cards first. And that's our job. Speaking of which, uh, which of you in your group has the uh, grab bags? Do you know which one of you collected those? I mean, I'll just say that I have the one sure. that, that I, like, that we, you know. Because you just gained the two. Mm -hmm. Yeah, would have gotten. Okay. I don't know who has the others. Sure thing. At this point, without you even doing anything, the ropes kind of fall mm -hmm. off the bag. Just by themselves. Okay, can I uh, reach in and grab... Yeah, you... So, Damien, uh, you had the bags for your group, correct? Yes. This... Except I think Hans had one. 
Oh shit! Bro. Oh, Wherever oh he went. no! Oh, oh, I'm down a car, boys. All the way in the back and uh, him, bro. <laughs> okay, excellent. Dig right. him out of the rubble. <laughs> but I did have the other. Ones. All right, you had the other three. So the same thing happens. The rope kind of unravels and falls to the ground by itself. Oh my god! Is there is there gotcha music, Joe? Wait, 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 wait. It just turns into Hong Kong stuff, man. I ha hold on. Give me a sec. This is the closest thing. Oh, oh man. Shit. Okay, damn. Wait, actually, first I'm just like a thousand yard stare. Because we got picked up. <laughs> okay, okay, let's, let's, right. let's address that first. <laughs> there's a lot of there's a lot of going there's a lot going on. Hugo yells, Damien, are you okay? Yeah. Hugo yelled? Hugo runs up yeah. to you. Yes he did. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. <sighs> big, 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 big lady. And Eden was there too. Duke went after Hans, and he looks off in the direction, uh, sort of like west of the uh, piano room, an area that you hadn't explored. That's good. That's good. We need him. He has a bag. <laughs> we we got to make sure he's okay, because he has a bag. <laughs> yeah, that, that too. That does... <laughs> that what he did was pretty cool, though. He <laughs> could. I didn't expect it from him. Same here. Well, I hope he's okay. He looks at the uh, the grab bags. Are they open? I believe we can open them. He like looks off to where Duke went. What should we do first? Let's uh, <clears throat> let's let's open them. I'm sure the Duke has what he has under control, and then we'll go follow the Duke. He went to, into where again? The ballroom, did you say? He he points towards the ballroom. Yeah. I'd forgotten yeah, how okay. you mentioned that, the ballroom. And I'll, All right. I'll move us back there. Let's do this first. Let's get Eden some good cards. Yeah. Come on, big money. <laughs> and even despite the serious situation, you can tell Hugo is intrigued by what you're about to open. So... Once you open the bag, it contains a booster pack. And it has like the total value recall logo on the pack. And you can feel oh, there's only three cards inside. Who's on, who's on the cover what? of the booster pack? How much should we pay for him? Who's on the cover of the booster pack? Let me... Is it, is it a blue eyes? Oh, yeah, version? yeah, true. What kind of booster pack is it? Let me, let me. Let is, me. It like a, is it like a starter is one? It, like a is, it one? <laughs> is it metal readers? Is it like a ranker one? Like, what are we, what's going on? I can I can determine it, actually, and this is exactly... And where did you get the booster pack? Okay, chill, chill, chill. Like... Well, well, yeah. How much does it weigh? How much does it weigh? It's, it's <laughs> not that heavy. That's actually the most important question. <laughs> Yeah, do I need to flip it? Do I need to flip it upside down and then reveal it? Like, <laughs> yeah. cards? Now, like yeah. character cards or like item? Or, you you gotta mean? flip two to the front. You gotta flip yeah, two. Yeah, to the yeah, front. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so the one that's featured on the oh, ooh, this was pure chance. The one that's featured on this pack is Eden. Oh. Hey. Alright. Right. Appropriate. Not appropriate. So there you go. Very cool. All right, let's open the Eden booster. So, Joe, here's what I'm gonna have you do. All right. Oh boy. Do you have a D100 on you? Yeah, D100. Like the percentage die and then the D10. I, a he D1... rolls digitally. You just yeah. Put... So I can just ah. click on the D100. one D100. So oh. I guess 80? I rolled an 80. On episode 80. Oh Let's my go. gosh. Oh. Whoa. 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. The oh, oh, cut, cut the stream. All right. I, stream. Give me a second to find it because uh, this is how I have a certain Good system. Bombers, baby. Give me a sec. <laughs> now, I want to clarify this is entirely random. Oh, wait. 80, you said. Oh my God. Yeah. So, Joe, me, I got the, <laughs> the the first I'll, I'll bring it up on screen. You messed up. The first card that you pull is on screen now. <gasps> Simon. Oh man, is he the ultra rare? I don't know. <laughs> it's gonna depend on <laughs> your other rolls. So that's the first card hey, you pull. Hey, Hugo, I know this guy. 
I uh, <laughs> he just like looks at you like you better. <laughs> <laughs> activate three shinsu discard any number of cards and then draw the same number but he costs five that's expensive for that hmm yeah but it's fun well <laughs> head up <laughs> sorry. <laughs> sorry I thought it was this crazy. is there this is <laughs> I'm just kidding all right what's the second card this is good to cycle. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on. Come on, Hugo. Hugo, you pull this one out, okay? I'm closing my eyes. and, just, and Okay, uh, I guess I'm the one rolling then. Hugo. Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah. yeah, yeah. Hugo reaches into the uh, booster pack. That is a 40. Oh, we're just having it. Oh, my God. So the, 40 plus 40 so, is 80. So the card that he pulls, I'll show it here on the screen. Uh, the card that he pulls is oh here we go uh, oh uh, come on zoom my boy jerry jerry's jerry's if he doesn't have the highest hp gets three holy that's that's actually his, his value is one but he said that's a strong card though and it's a strong fighting card and if people wish to find out about advantage, it's in the rule book. So that's the card that Hugo holds. I'm just imagining like, no, no, sorry, keep continuing, continue. No, I just, okay. <laughs> you're good. All right, here we go. This is the ultra rare. This is the ultra rare of the pack. Okay. All right. I, I, I know you didn't say mm -hmm. what is the ultra rare, but assume we're, let's just pretend this one's a shiny foil. Okay. Okay. <laughs> A shiny this foil one is a foil. I agree. The third one will be a foil. It doesn't matter to me. All right. Here we go. 43. Oh. 43. Come oh on. Oh, my God. Good card for Eden. I mean, I can't. I can't. <clears throat> the card that you pull <gasps> hey, is, a, is a, hol a holographic the shiny, jong. The shiny foil jong. Oh, my God. We can get so much money, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, if we sell this on the market! What oh, the hell do I do not sell my car? <laughs> <laughs> Son of a bitch! <laughs> this is so funny. <clears throat> oh, this will be good. This is gonna be real good, guys. Yo, other Joe, I'll trade you. Above the table, I'll trade you. Huh? I guess. <laughs> I'll trade for, you. This is for Eden. Though. What? Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Mother, I told man. you they're not gonna help me. They're just gonna keep the cards. <laughs> yeah, they're like, <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> There's no reason I can't help you and have fun. Okay, damn. <laughs> I shout, I shout up to the, uh, out, out around the dollhouse. I got you, Jong Eden. I got you, Jong. I got you, S J J. All I hear is <laughs> Simon Jerry's Jong. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> He's just like, huh? Oh, she's with her dad now, so she can't hear you. Uh, uh, that. So that's one booster pack. Feels good. All right, let's let's bang out the next. <laughs> Are we one. doing the next one right away? Let's just let's just do it right now. I'll I'll I'll, I'll do it real quick. Okay, so forty for the first one. Forty. This is exciting. Yeah, forty. Uh, for, 41. 41. Sorry, forty-one. 41. Sorry, forty-one. Like, forty-one. All right, first card that you pull. This is not a holographic. Let's be. Let's be clear. Oh, there she is, Janice. Oh, Janice. Win, played, and kill. Whoa, whoa that's dark. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Janice is actually pretty good. All right. You may discard one card to draw two cards. That gives you card draw. All right, you can do it twice. That And you get one gold. Okay, Jan, I think Jan So to clarify, Jan when it says gold plus one, at the start of every resource phase, you get an extra gold. Yeah, I was about to say, that adds on to your initial resource, right? It's not Yes, no matter what oh, dice okay, you okay. pick, you always yeah, yeah, get yeah, one yeah, extra gold. And if she stays out for a long time, she just continues to rack up the gold until discarded, correct? Yep. Cool. You pulled it. And then played and, and killed, you get to draw two cards. You get to draw four cards and discard two cards. It's a cycle. It's good. Okay, that's a good card. That's a good card. All right, next card. I got two, Joe. I got two. <clears throat> you got a two. You got a two. This is yeah, exciting. Two. Oh my god. Oh no. 
Oh, Ace, man. Let's go. Whoa. Ranged. Wait, ranged? Wait, they're both spear bears? Nope. So no, some cards that are oh. not spear bears still have uh, provoke or range. Range. Oh. It's like an ability that's yeah. It's just that all spear bears naturally have ranged. Oh, it's a gamble. Deal She's four damage. Deal one damage. Let's go. It's like that one Pikachu card from the original <laughs> Pokemon trading card game. And you gave her the Icier background, Joseph? Dang. Well, oh, check out her me. factions. We, we don't, there's yeah. no, like, full art cards, right? Are we? Is, is that kind of bougie to ask? I don't I'm know. sorry. There's no full art cards. Okay, okay. I'm, okay. I'm sorry, Isaiah. I know. I, I just, I just want to throw the question Not out. Yet. It, this, the this is first edition, bro. One day there right, will be first right. edition. You know what? You're absolutely right. You're second edition. Look, I got you. I got Ace, you. Ace could be the first gen Charizard, so let's just, you know. Oh, my God. All right, this is the foil. This, is, this is the shiny foil. The foil. All right, foil. it's the foil. 25, 25. 25? Wait, I gotta, I gotta cut the music. Uh-oh. Oh, wait, you said 25? 25. So, uh, <laughs> 25? Oh, no. Of... What is this, Joe? Oh, uh, your holographic card, Joe. I'll put it on screen now. Oh! <laughs> oh my god! I'm not kidding. There are 99 character cards, and that's the hollow you landed on. Congrats. Anybody who says I have bad luck, I want you to take it back right now. Yeah, but you used it all in pulling cards, bro. Yeah, I was just about to say, like, you traded it all for the cards. Yeah, yeah, yeah. important. Oh, shit. I mean, yeah, you're right, you're right. This is beyond but damn, important. This is but beyond. damn, you used all of that shit. Holy crap. I got Ace and Flux Hulk in the up. same pack. Oh, oh it, would, it wouldn't have hurt to get, like, an item card. But you know, your pulls are crazy, bro. Your pulls oh, crazy. man. So I will say that some booster packs oh, are character wow. only and some are like um, vice versa. So these are character oh. booster packs. Wait, can you choose which Wait, pack so, you pull yeah, from? Do, how do we, do we, are we? Do, you'll, like, you'll acquire them. Or? You'll acquire them. Uh, for now, I these are all character that. booster packs. Uh, all right. Oh, okay. Dang, Damien. Gets Pat power Pat 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 equivalent to ICR and recall value. Holy. We have Jong and Ace. Ace counts as wait. Does Ace count as two? Because she's Icier and Recall. She sure is. Oh no, she counts oh. as one. She counts. She counts as one. Okay. Okay. Yeah, she yeah, has yeah, three yeah, factions yeah. on her name. What do you? I'm saying you can't. You don't get two. She doesn't count for two characters. Dang it. I apologize. All right. Her one-liners though. Gaming. You're not wrong. Hugo is like. See, he he's still getting used to the fact that all these people that he knows are like on these cards with values and stuff. I'm not on one of these, am I? Well, you most certainly are, Hugo. Hell yeah, brother. You're definitely on here. You can tell he's nervous. There are, there are 99. Get your credit card out, kids. <laughs> 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 We're buying packs. We're doing a pack opening <laughs> night tonight. <laughs> you thought this was a Towers of God stream? No. <laughs> Yo, I'm going to send you a series of numbers real quick. <laughs> <laughs> I, think, I think that's all the packs I can open, though, right, Joe? Right? Uh, I think Hans is the yep. other one. Uh, no, because you had uh, a total of oh, okay, four okay. amongst your okay, group, okay, I okay. think. So you have one I'll, other. I have four. Okay, okay. I'll, I'll 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 do this one real quick, and then we can go to John's group. Sounds I'm, good. I'm sorry. I'm 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 hyping it. I'm I'm he, going. This is hype. It's hype. Yeah. yeah. I understand. So uh, I got 58 wow. on the first one. 58. Let me find which one that is. I gotta stop like snow. I gotta stop reacting when you roll these. Okay. <laughs> Fifty-eight. The first card you pull is. No! Oh my god! I'm not, I'm not kidding. <laughs> you can't make this up. I I swear to God. <laughs> well, other Joe. <laughs> you just see Damien pull one card out of the pack. He looks at. It, he just drops. He's like, oh. oh. <laughs> Bend it, bend the pack, bend the pack. <laughs> and he goes like, what's wrong? And it's like, oh, oh. <laughs> There are 99 Actually, of the cards them. are minus one? Wait, that's pretty good. Right, that's that's like, uh, what? All, all, all spells cost like one less mana in Hearthstone rules. Exactly. Oh, that's pretty good, okay. And she's uh, too, that's not bad. <laughs> True. 
Wait, so like even AOE spells? Or yeah, I don't, actually, any I don't, any I don't action, any yeah, action, any action, right? Yeah. Uh, any action Joe just confirmed there are there are AOE spells. All right, let's. <laughs> oh, I'm not dear. afraid to confirm that. It's not. Damn, oh, got him. <laughs> <laughs> seventy nine, Joe. Seventy nine, big money. Seventy nine, seventy nine. Uh, that means other Joe out here pulling his harem. It's scary. All right. Oh shoot! I give me. I I did the wrong thing. Give me just a moment. Uh, I, there may be two cards appearing on screen. Don't worry about it. There's only one. There you go. <gasps> My baby! You got Ace and Silly Young. You got the pair. I did. There's see there that one. Ignore. Okay. He doesn't get the recall like bonus. No, I'm sorry. Mm. He gets the, the adopted bonus though. At the end of each round, heal two HP to all <laughs> for all your characters. I assume does Mila count? <laughs> She's spellproof, right? So if you read the rules, spellproof only applies to the opponent's action cards. Ah, uh, excellent. Okay. Yep. Wow. I think Sil Young's a good card too. All right. What's your holographic, Joe? I think everyone. We're dying to know. Sixty-eight. Sixty-eight. <laughs> Alrighty, let me do this. Here we go. Here we go, the hollow. <laughs> ah, your hollow is wait, I gotta I gotta hype up the drum roll. Oh, oh booyah shaka! We got Orichasa. Deals two damage to wave controllers. Ooh. No plus Trash. two. <laughs> Trash. Discard that. Discard that. <laughs> no, this, this is actually not that bad. First card we got. She most mid. Out of every, compared to who is mid as yeah, fuck. Bro, honestly, it, no, no, no. Bad, but compared to what you pulled today, that's <laughs> the I mean, trash. That's the trashiest card you pulled. I actually, this is actually above like a top tier card. I'm gonna tell you why. <laughs> it's not, but okay. So anyway. This is all right. I'm gonna tell you why because this is this is a spear bear, correct? Uh, yes, it is. So spear bears can attack whoever they want, basically, right? Without taking uh, well, they trading damage. Yep. Yeah, yeah. So this this person is able to snipe any like wave like wave controllers for three damage for free. Bro, for she has one, one health. For one, about? but it's He's one a gold. One one. She's it's a, a one one. Yeah, but, like, but she but even. she cost she costs actually, one. Not gold. even. I, exactly. No. But so I'm, 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 I'm gonna give you deference and be like, yeah, she's a one one. So simply. <laughs> put, like, yeah. If she's like, a good pawn no, card, bro, you're no, not, no, you're not, no, no, no. This is good value. Put her in the background, Joe. This is not right. <laughs> That's he the hollow. The you got a hollow Orichasa. Yeah, you, no, no, no. I mean, this with is, a fisherman this... on the field, you, you could pretty much protect it, so. Yeah. Hmm? That's a good point. That's a good point. That's why you attack with everyone else first. Snipes kill the fisherman, and then you have Orichasa kill the, the, the wave controller in the back. Right? I think I think that's that's correct. Unless I'm like misunderstanding the rules, I think Orichasa is, is actually a top card. All right. <clears throat> Can I ask that's a question? I you with your last pack, what was the second card? You pulled uh, Janus, then something, then Flux. What was it? Oh, it's Ace. Thank you. Yeah. It's uh, Simon, Jerry, Sion, I got it, yeah. Janus, Ace, Flux, I think... Silly Young, Perfect. Orichasa. Thank you. Perfect. Okay. I'm excited. Except, did we kill Orichasa? No. That was the one we didn't kill, right? She survived. Hugo? Yeah. <laughs> Hugo, he, he's just, he just shrugs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, baby. At this point, <laughs> yeah. Ah, uh, that was before your time, Hugo. <laughs> All right, Hugo. We got some good cards, and I, I guess we spirit them away to, to, to eat. Not yet. Not yet. Oh, okay. 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 Yeah. Not yet. Okay. Hugo, uh... Let us go and let us go and find Hans and the Duke of Bones. Make sure they're okay. You mean make sure the pack is okay? Yes. <laughs> well, both, but he nods. He nods. <laughs> the two of you head off. Meanwhile, Brax Group, uh, Jong, you notice that there are booster packs within the two bags. What's the picture on the pack, Joe? That is the correct question to ask, Joe. 
I, I, I forgot about it. The picture on the pack is Brooke. Feeling kind of nice about this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Teacher. <clears throat> she owned, like, kind of smiles. Huh. I haven't seen that face in a while. Um, I don't have a uh, D100, though, so I don't know. Um, in roll 20, oh, all you gotta do is. Oh, in roll 20. Uh, uh, was it, was it slash? Uh, what is it? It's forward slash uh, hmm. roll and then space 1D100. So, like. Like that. But with a, with a slash in front of roll. Oh, okay. Perfect. So, so Jong's opening the pack? Uh, yeah, I guess. Okay. Lonnie's kind of like looking over your shoulder, like, curiously. It's an exciting thing, Lonnie. I understand. I understand. <laughs> Blue leader has a childish side. Who would have? <laughs> this is a CJ coming out. All right. Well, CJ I coming out. That right. No, it's not. That's not correct. Is that not right? Right, for unless I'm here. Uh, uh, nothing was sent into the chat at all. You can try that, Isaiah. Okay. <clears throat> oh, I think I put um. Whoa! Okay, well, wait! Whoa! That's... Milios, what happened there? <laughs> the case. I you see. rolled a zero point two zero four oh zero eight. How is that possible? He there... divided. <laughs> that's kind of awesome. <laughs> Ugh. How are you rolling? Wait. Oh, there we go. All okay. right. There we go. All there right. Go. The first card I mean, has I been put, pulled. I, there was no spaces. That's what it was. 85. 85. 85. Give it to me straight, Doc. Ooh. You, you feel this, like... This is weird how this is lining up. You feel oh, this, uh -oh. like, warm feeling inside of you. No. No. Oh, no! Oh, sponge. He's like, I forgot he was <laughs> such he a sickness. <laughs> eh, alright, alright. Let's let's keep going. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Not a bad card. Not a bad card. Nah, I it's mean, a big card too though. Yeah, I like mid. the art it's... though. The art is fire, but like the card is trash. I mean the art's literally his funeral, so that's kinda of fucked up. <laughs> listen, like... <laughs> listen, listen. <laughs> I'm not saying nothing more. That's it. That's all I'm saying. I'm just saying, you know, like we could, uh, you know, draw him with eyes open, maybe. Poor I'm sponge. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'd be a hypocrite if I praise this after after the. the <laughs> oh I mean, man, it is, it he was in Brook's pack right. too. Right. It is, he was in the Brook pack. Oh no! Whoa! If you oh, pull man. Nissan next, I'm going home. That was a curse in disguise. That's weird. Oh no, Nissan's definitely in the pack. He's definitely in the pack. Someone is really napping. He's not dead. That's true. They, <laughs> he's not dead. <laughs> uh, technically, he's very dead. <laughs> Go ahead. He's alive in your head. That is he not the same thing as alive in the flesh. Uh, that's all I'm saying. You gave him resting, too. That's, that's <laughs> <I did. laughs> uh, 80, Joe, for the second. Uh, uh, a repeat. <clears throat> that is a, a dupe, as we say in the industry. It's another Simon. But you don't know that Damien pulled the other Simon, so... Wait, I forget. Hold on, what was this thing? Uh... Okay. Okay, okay. <laughs> What's the hollow? And here comes the hollow. Yeah, here we go. Oh, I'm so fucking scared. I'm not gonna lie, I'm so scared. <laughs> Please don't be trash. Please don't be trash. <gasps> Twenty-seven. Twenty-seven. 27. 27. You pulled the hollow. Oh, shoot. 27. All right. Oh, frick. Oh, I always do that. There's going to be two cards that pull up on screen. Don't worry about it. I am a goofball. All right. Here we go. Oh, okay. Uh, ooh, oh, oh. Uh, holographic Gabriel. Wait, I can't. Hold on, hold on. That's kind of fire, though. Ooh, yes, that Ooh. is. A little tad pricey, but he's a ranker. I get it, I get it. Okay, okay. I mess with that. All right, again. Let's do it again. 
Go. <laughs> this will do nicely in our flexible <laughs> control. What's the pack? What's the pack? What's on the cover of the pack? Oh, the cover of the pack. What's on the cover of the pack? It's like not what we're doing. <laughs> the cover of the pack is a. Uh, the cover of the pack is Leonida. Oh. Knight of Aesir. Okay, so I remember who that is, but for the class, why don't you just go ahead and, you know. Leonida is a Knight of Aesir who uh, met you all at Train City to give you the clarification on what you're looking for on the mirror train to help Leaf. Oh. She wears like yeah. a... She has a baseball bat and motorcycle helmet. Yeah, I remember now. Okay, okay. okay well. <laughs> this is going to be the pack that has zero ICU people in it. Bro, if this <laughs> is an ICU pack, I'm quitting, bro. I'm just this telling is... you right now. There will be zero ICU cards in this ICU pack. I'm just telling you. Huh. That, I, I would welcome that, bro. Or you know what? I'll just say no to your set. Actually, he's probably a busted card, so I, I do want to your set. He's probably Either a that or it's card. trash card. <laughs> wow. No, but Joe, I, he, no, no. If he's in here, he's going to be a totally <clears> broken. <throat> Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, what, do we got? what do we got? 39! 39! Your 39. first Getting pull me. is... Alrighty! First pull is... Ah. It's a buck and bronco. <laughs> <Why don't you laughs> <go>? <laughs> <clears throat> I mean, she's a bull. I, I apologize. Uh, okay, okay. For people right. watching, initiative means you can attack the first turn you're played. <laughs> that is actually something I failed to mention, I think. All character cards are rested the turn that they're played. The round that they're played. That is okay, an important point. Doesn't have to be rested? Is that that's she, what thing? When she's played, she just... she's not rested from turn one. So the sponge card gets more value then, because he starts off rested then, right? No, because you have to play an action card for him to then rest. Oh. Yeah, I think every card gets rested when you play it. Every character card. By I forgot default, to mention right? that detail. Yeah. Okay. By default, unless they have initiative. Right, right, okay. So and that, that just mean that means she goes first, card, right? Card. Like she's the first one. It means that she can, the, the turn that you play her, she can attack that turn, that round. Oh, okay. I see what you're saying. Because normally you have to wait a whole okay, round. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Right, you have to wait a whole. I got you. 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 Okay. Next um, number. All right. Let's get this. Let's get this. The next roll is 24. 24. Oh, my God. Oh, God no. damn it. Why? Why? Why are you doing this to me? I thought we were friends, bro. Like, I thought this was cool. I thought. Uh, I'm quitting, but what is this? No! Really? Uh. <laughs> no, I'm done. I'm done. We're out. This is definitely nah. the bent pack, for sure. Um, no, wait! Over. He's immune to all fisherman damage! It's over. <laughs> Eat it. It's a wrap, bro. I'm sorry. He has zero value! <laughs> this card is kind of key. <laughs> That's <laughs> right! <laughs> No, 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 but he denies. No. He denies the no. fisherman value. He the really if he can fight no, no, a fisherman, no, 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 he has no, 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 no value. No, 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 no. That game but is he, to acquire more value. But he denies no, 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 no. enemy. Value. Like, I want to know who designed this one, yo. That was cool. If he destroyed <laughs> other fishermen, I would get what you're saying. But he's not adding to, like, the goal. <laughs> okay. There's more, there's more than I'll say. I'll Look, say. first of all, he, the art is, is God tier. Like, I actually Shout like Shout out, Mon. I didn't even like. Oh, yeah, the art is fire, but I'm not arguing about the art. Okay. The art. But no, no, no. But look, at the, but, but, look, but look at the parameters and look at the immunity, dude. Like, if, this is utility. This is straight utility. It's not because of uh, 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 you know, there are four other multiple, positions that can just clap them. There, one uh, mimicy in the there's, pocket. There's, there's potential. I'll, I'll, just one, one mimicy in the pocket goes a long way, dude. I think Maybe. so too. You yeah, might I you agree. might be going up against a, a a fisherman heavy deck. You know what I'm saying? The sun is right because fishermen are going to be tanky. Other Joe you Hush. Can, you take out the <laughs> no. You take out the fisherman. You take out the fisherman. <laughs> um, when you pull the Mimithy card, Lonnie goes, "Oh, is that another friend of yours?" And John looks like what? <laughs> Does... <laughs> I'm assuming that's over the table. <laughs> uh. I mean, he get, does give her a weird look. Like, why'd you say that? <clears throat> All right. What's your holographic? 
Come on, this is dog, pack, right? save this pack. This is your yes. last pack. Yeah, this pack is, all right, all right, let's see. Come on, come on, now. Come on, now. Come on now. Pull Victor, pull Victor. 80, not, oh, I get Victor, bro. Just, I just, I'll be, just give me a team recall number. That's that, I know that's the meta, bro. That's, that's what I'm, I need, I need a recall. 89. What do we got, 89. A 89. holographic. No whammies, no whammies, no whammies. What do we got, what do we got? Oh. oh no. <laughs> there he is. Gladio oh. in the flesh. All right, I quit, peace. Please. <laughs> and and, and oh, there he goes. <laughs> Dude, Big Daddy Thaddeo is actually OP. <laughs> Don't call him. Oh, Don't call him. <laughs> I, think, I think he's pretty good utility. He's again. pretty OP, dude. Look at that. Look Man, at at least that. he has a vibe. That's the only thing I can Son, do. can you turn off your camera and turn it on? I don't know what happened. I think Isaiah, like, crashed your camera somehow. I don't oh, know how. There we go. Oh, I said I don't have it. Isaiah, yeah. I know you're upset, but could you turn on your camera? Look, you gotta have you gotta have some bad packs in the boxes, you know, to balance everything out. I don't, don't that bad, though. Oh man. That what, was a rough yeah. pack though, not gonna lie. Oh man. What's up, no, Emilio? Some fire meta pulls that he doesn't even No, like, bro, yeah, I I compared to other Joe. Bro, you're just no. How do I get more packs, bro? If you want these, bro, like Joe, Joe, how do I get more packs? What's 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 the game here? I uh, well, first Ooh. you put your credit card. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Send me a PayPal. Send we'll Joe talk. Your credit card number and the all funny right, so, little numbers right. on the back. I'll send you the number. <laughs> Gotta walk to the uh, Tower Eleven. I think that is pretty good. Products. Like that, that it's, was really good. It's, that it's, is really good. Like. Ramp Thaddeo, he'll duplicate <laughs> your single <laughs> If he costed like, like one less gold, or no, 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 I'm, I would say he can duplicate your gold. Yeah, but that, oh, no, it's trash, it's trash, it's trash. Well, you gotta collect that resource three times. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. You have to, like, if you. There's a prerequisite. It's like a late game card. I mean, like, you know what I mean? Once you're on, I think it was round three or whatever, mm -hmm. whichever one doubles your, your, uh, I think like, he gets he gets value as soon as he gets onto the field. I mean, no, not no, like no, value, I'm saying, value. I'm talking, not talking about value. I'm talking about his resource. It costs three gold to play. So I'm, you know, unless you get lucky, you're not gonna be able to play him until round. What is it? Three. Depending on the dice rolls. I need you to could start with the, you could start with yeah, like six yeah. gold, so then you could play him off the hop. But I mean, even. Uh, more importantly, it, it, Ruka situation. chimed in and said, Nefta's running a gotcha. <laughs> <Listen>. She absolutely <laughs> is. Nefta's she a gotcha. absolutely yeah. is. Of course she is, bro. She doesn't just want Eden's soul and emotions. She wants her credit card number two. <laughs> <laughs> and honestly, I mean, that's, that's the most evil thing you should do. Yeah. She's probably the CEO of the Towers version <laughs> of Wizards of the Coast. Do you know how hard uh, it is to fix your tower credit score? It's near impossible. It's so, impossible. Uh, <laughs> but imagine those ads where it's like, Eden needs your help. Please insert your credit card. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, oh my, my god. I'm bringing in the points. Oh my gosh. Um, chat Why said, can can't compare to other Joe. Man basically pulled an Egyptian god card from a, from a mid pack. That's true. That's like, so like Joe so... set the bar quite no, high. This whole messed up, bro. The, the so Eden boosters up. are good. All right. I guess that's the meta, bro. We should have been going for the Eden boosters. What I had, well, I had bro I, the first one was Brooke, so like I thought I was good. I thought I was I good. All five pieces of Exodia. <laughs> or like four, basically. Like, damn. <clears throat> okay. I'm, I'm worried, though. We didn't get any spells so far. Well, he said they're all going to be, the like, more right, character Joe, packs the first right ones now. are going to be character packs. Oh. Think, yep. Like, we're going to look for other ones. So, I, yeah, I think. That's right. Because we only have what? There was that too. Damien, you have four packs? Yeah. Damien had three, but Hans has the fourth one. Okay, that's right. and, but that's in total. Mm -hmm. We only have six, right? Yeah. Or like that's what we that's collected. That's correct. So far. Okay. Yeah. So, so far. we gotta get more. Hans was just sent to the Nether Realm with that pluck, right? <laughs> I mean, pretty much. We just need the pack, though. Like, I don't know where he went, but that's not really. I mean, but the pack is on him, so if, you know we can't get the pack because <laughs> hey, let, we're gone. we're gonna we're gonna mm. go back into character now. We're gonna we're gonna re-enter characters whoops i say as i cut to the cards we just pulled huh lonnie's just looking at all the cards you all pulled interesting 
I feel like, Jong, you didn't pull bad cards, right? <clears throat> They're trash. I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I love this idea that Jog is like deep down, like super into card games. He's, he's, he's like so really, salty. Really, really fucks with cards. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> oh, man. Well, obviously, we gotta go out there and get more cards, says Ryobe. We only have a three hour time limit and we've already spent. 10, 15 minutes. Let's go, team! Brack, you agree with me, correct? Huh? Hmm? Huh? What's going on? Were you sleeping throughout that whole... We could have pulled your card or my card. There's cards? Uh, Don't worry about it, Brack. We'll tell you later. <laughs> anyway, we should leave. Maybe there's more opportunities to get other kinds of cards um, throughout the mansion. Maybe some of the other groups got some cards, too. Yeah, let's go meet up with the others. All right. And we're off. All right. Eden, I'm going to cut back to you. Okay. So mm -hmm. you flip the switch, mm -hmm. and you find yourself in the same seat. But in the room with uh, Sigmund, he's hands together, like leaning towards you. Like as soon as you appear, he's been looking at you. He he, yeah. he was he's been waiting for it. You can see on her face, it's just kind of like a mixture of like, what do I do? But also like, there's a little bit of anger in there. There's like like angrily frustrated. Well. Papa, I fell into her trap. She challenged you to a game? A card game. And she'll hold up the card that she gave her. That checks out. Yeah. And he just knows how to push all of my buttons. It's... He holds out his hand towards the card, like open. She'll, yeah, she'll hand it to him. He's staring at it. And then he smiles. Seems like a pretty good card. <laughs> well, it's worth nothing in the game rules, that is, but it tracks. I think there's more to the game's rules than just value. How do you figure? Based on the card text and based on what I know about Nefta, you're able to block for other cards. In addition to having a spear bearer ability, there's a lot going on for you here. Don't let Nefta's value amount fool you. I think this card is pretty good. <laughs> You're biased, Papa. It's just because I'm on it. How am I biased? Even if you weren't you my are... daughter, I'd think the same thing. You're <laughs> biased and you know it. Uh, maybe a little. <laughs> and for the... For, he... <clears throat> he stands up from the chair, which was something he was hesitant to do before. And he walks to the side of the room, and you can see a couple books on a shelf, and mm -hmm. he pulls one back, and then a door like swings open, and sunlight starts to pour into the room. And he looks back towards you and holds out a hand. Care to walk with me? Yeah. And she'll jump up and grab his hand. <laughs> and he walks out of the room and the light blinds your eyes, especially being in Nefta's room for so long. And, mm -hmm. and we're going to take our break. What? Already? 
Yeah, I feel like I keep Why? delaying the break. So, in the recent episodes, we're gonna take our break. If you wanna find out what happens next, you wanna find out what other cards get pulled, you wanna find out where Eden's going, find out after the break. Enjoy the memes, enjoy the fan art, and we'll see you shortly. Make sure you.
Welcome back, everybody. Welcome back, everybody, to Towers and Gods. Happy to have you here. Thank you to everybody who submitted during the break. You're all legends. The fan art and the memes have been spectacular. So thank you once again. If you want to contribute, join the Discord, and we'll feature your memes and fan art next week. Um... What else? Uh, don't forget to leave a like if you're enjoying the episode. Uh, if you want to read up more on the card game, the document is in the Discord server. Feel free to read up, and we'll we'll see where it goes from here. But we're gonna start with Eden. Hold on. And oh, that's thank you, right. Dad, for 80 memberships. Oh thank my you. gosh, you're insane. Thank you so much. Let's go, dog. You were not kidding. That's insane. Thank you for your support, and everybody enjoy using the emojis. Enjoy using Towers and Gods emojis. Um, thank you very much, Dart Angel. Really appreciate your support throughout the whole series. It means a lot. Mm -hmm. um, I actually want to say one more thing, too. Uh, I only featured one stat from De uh, Devlin, but Devlin made stats for like the past 15 episodes, so you can go check all of them out in the Discord server if you do want to do that. Let's go. Okay. We're going right. to get started with Eden. A little bit of Eden here. Yay. So um, when you walk outside, it's nature. You hear birds chirping and tweeting, and it's picturesque. Like, it's, it couldn't be more different as far as an atmosphere from the, the, the tension and the, the chains creaking and the dollhouse in Nefta's room. It's, you, it, there's trees around you and there's a couple of lawn chairs, like white chairs outside around a garden of roses. And it's just like this little area, like in the middle of a forest. And it's like this, there's the, the grass has parted and it's, it's, it's like cleared for this little peaceful area with these two chairs in the middle of the forest and Sigmund kind of stops you can always come back here to rest whenever you wish but I wanted to hear a bit and he turns to face you I wanted to hear about your journey oh uh yeah Sure, uh, uh... My daughter is a regular. <laughs> and you've made it to floor 39. That's an accomplishment. It's... something. <laughs> you can tell, like, she's, like, a little flushed and a little nervous, just like, oh, what do I tell him? <laughs> you don't need to say anything you're uncomfortable with. I know, it's... Okay, so... And then you start to walk side by side. Yeah. So we ended up on the second floor. That was... Uh, yeah. What? Is that where you met your teammates? Uh, yeah, yeah. And like, you could tell like, she was going to say something else, and she just kind of like shrugs it off. Uh, yeah, we we kind of all woke up on a boat in the middle of a bunch of water, and uh, we had to, like, it was called King of the Seas, and, like, we had to take over islands and change flags, and it was, it was wild. Unfortunately, it was a, you know, kind of a kill or be killed test. Of but course. We made it. <laughs> and, uh... And you had seen Regulus... Yeah, he's something. <laughs> he was really weird, Papa. Like, he, he gave off this air of like, oh, I'm nice. And then, then he brought up Mother and... Regulus has he said been if... around for a long time. Yeah. His... Age and experience, however, probably didn't lend itself in certain situations in his communications with you, where perhaps he was trying to make an impression. But more than anything, he turns and stares at you. He knew that they were interested in you. They as in... You know I who I speak. I've seen too much Lord of the Rings lately. Oh my god. <laughs> Sigmund watches Lord of the Rings. Noted. Um, <laughs> you didn't keep it secret, all right? Okay. 
Anything, Papa. Um, so you know about them. And he pauses and looks at you, and it's like a moment of, in the back of your mind, you know that this isn't all reality. Mm-hmm. And it's like a moment of, like, reminder of that. He knows what you know all at the end of the day, yeah. you know? But he doesn't say it out loud. Yeah. Right. Yeah, he said if it... He said it's like his hands were tied, and if he could have had it his way, he would have killed all of us. So it was, it was weird, and... And he compared me to a friend that had gotten caught up in ice here, and she died, and... Crazy and coincidence. Running with... yeah, too many. The job of the second floor ruler... I know because... I was friends with someone who used to work on that floor, and... They just stop the dangers from climbing further. So we're considered dangerous? So far, there's been no one that would get considered dangerous, but Regulus is different. While everyone else calls him crazy, he's certain that someday someone will enter and shake this tower, and he will stop them if he deems it necessary. Oh. I think he thought the five of you might have been that something. But maybe he changed his mind. Or maybe he thought there was value to be earned from the five of you. Well, considering he knows Mama, maybe he thought there was no value. <laughs> that we weren't dangerous after all. But anyway, it's... He let us go, so that's something. But yeah, we had a run-in with Icear and... Now we're dragged into their whole mess. They're strange. And then we moved on to the sick, you know, we climbed up, and then the sixth floor is where everything went badly. And I was so arrogant, Papa. I thought I, I thought I had everything where I wanted it. Every everything from power to you know, being elected the leader by the team, and I just, I thought I had everything under control for the first time. And, and then and everything went shattered. sideways. <sighs> yeah. Test administrators in this tower can range from jovial, carefree, and it's like an image pops up in your mind of Lazarus, Mm-hmm. To monstrous, bored people who just want sport. They want to do... They will do anything to break up the monotony. Because to them, what's a sixth floor regular's life? Or what's the life of a thief who would be executed by the City Watch anyway? Might as well make some fun out of it. When you become a ranker someday, Eden. What kind of ranker will you be when faced with the life of someone infinitely weaker than yours? I hope that I'll still have the humanity left to remember that's where I was. I'm going to show them the same compassion that I should have been shown. He smiles. And that's strength. <laughs> and as you keep walking through the woods, and you, you have your own team, but you must have another team that you're friends with, right? Yeah, um, there's Team Blessing and Team Stexa. Team Stexa, friends from the second floor? Mm-hmm. 
He kind of smiles. Is there anyone on that team that you would consider a close friend? Or... Don't tell me. And he kind of looks at you. No family, right? Well, yeah. You see right through me all the time, Papa, and it's annoying. Yes. Cousin. There's a cousin on that team. Ari side of the family. Ari Boris. Oh, and a much further cousin Two from the cousins. Arie family. God, Cal and, uh, and our, the Arie family. That's the. Yeah, yeah, he could Papa. be a useful ally if he's in the strongest no. of the ten families. No, Papa, you haven't met him. He's something. Mm. Oh, he boy. has the arrogance of the REA, but not the strength to back it up, and it's a bad combo, Papa. I it's see. gonna get him killed if he's not careful. Let's hope he. Let's hope he finds his path sooner rather than later. <laughs> I think that would be good for him and his entire team, let's be honest. Who's the leader? Well, Team Stexa. Stexa's the leader. Stexa Webb. What do you think about her? She's a good leader. She's a good leader. What about as a friend? This whole seeing through me Papa thing is getting annoying. But yeah... Mm, I might have burnt that bridge. Is it wasn't she... intentional. It wasn't. It. She's just getting. She's getting too involved in the ICR stuff, and the more people get involved with the ICR stuff, the more they they get killed or they change. I just wanted to protect her from that. But she didn't heed my warning, and now she's in it even deeper than she can imagine. No one listens to me, Papa. You know... I don't have... many friends here at the... Well, he says here and then realizes... at the Ha estate. But from time to time, I'll talk with an old friend or a confidant from years ago and many of them told me a similar thing not to be involved with you or Nari really why because I thought if I did my lowly status as a consort of the Ha family wouldn't be Enough to spare me from getting killed. Maybe assassinated by a rival consort, or perhaps tried by the Ha family. But I stayed. Because I thought, even if I might die, it was... It would be more painful not to try to do my part as a piece this he kind of frowns of your life maybe that's what she's thinking too if I was denied the opportunity to stand with you as I did all those years ago I don't think I'd ever forgive myself You have good friends, Eden. Even if they don't listen to you sometimes. They don't listen to me anytime, Papa. And maybe, and he puts a hand on your hand, and maybe sometimes they have to learn the hard way, but maybe sometimes you have to learn to let go. I don't want to let go. <laughs> 
and she'll just kind of wrap her arms around him and just <laughs> kind of snuggle in. I know. I never said it was easy to let go. Is caring too much a bad thing, Papa? I feel like I just... I don't know, maybe I'm trying to appease myself. I try to care about others how I wish... Mama cared about me and how you care about me and... I cared about Nari and Farlin. Even Jen Sung. <laughs> He's not great at showing it, but... Yin. If you could turn back time... And you could... Have never spent... Those happy... Well... If you could have never spent... Those mornings waking up to Nari... Making breakfast, picking flowers, strolling through town, piano recitals. Would you choose to not have lived through any of that? I don't know. There's part of me that's... If I had been strong and I had become the princess that Mama wanted, Nari wouldn't have existed, but then she wouldn't have had to come through the pain. And those happy years are just a drop in the bucket of so much pain for everyone and not just, just me, but Farlin and Nari too. So I don't know. I don't know. Because if I could protect her from the pain, then I would do that. And so would I. But no one can predict the future. But what matters is... And he grabs both of your hands. happy days. The three of you created so many memories and we're so happy that no one can take that away from you. But they did. No. No one can take away. They did because she's gone. There's no more memories. There's no more anything. Just a hole in my heart. Because it's gone. And I keep trying to fill it with something. Anything. To make that go away. Ethan. This world is cruel. Crueler to you than anyone ever deserves that anyone has ever deserved. However, they cannot take away what you three had. Never. And even though this tower's unfair rules exist regarding the families and death and climbing, And someday everything will one day disappear. That happiness, the reason you feel the way you do, those days are locked away for no one to touch. In a special treasure chest that you can keep forever. And it'll hurt. But that just shows that it was real. You're right. Like 
I said you're always right. No. And he kind of pulls behind, goes behind his back and pulls something out. Nefta may be playing her games, but I did say that I would be on your side, didn't I? And he pulls out three cards. Oh. <laughs> That's me above table. That's me above table. <laughs> Are they shiny? What's going on? <laughs> Sigmund's got the broken cards. Let's go, Dad. <laughs> I can't offer you much. <laughs> I can't offer you much. But at least in this way, I'll do my part. And he flips the... Whoop. You guys saw nothing. <laughs> he flips the cards over, and he tells you, now you can only pick one. There's only... <laughs> There's only so much I'm able to do. And the three cards he he shows to you are connected to what we had just been uh, we had just been discussing. Oh with him. boy! They are three location cards. Oh. <gasps> Aww. Look at us goofies. On our boat on the you, second babies. floor. Babies, babies first test. Damien's like, let's be friends. <laughs> Everyone's like, huh? <laughs> Good old Damien. It's true. And his big old cape. It's true. That was totally was not it? great for the water. <laughs> All right, not Aww. bad for the first card, Papa. What else do we got? Come <laughs> <laughs> on, on. on. Wait a Damn, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking the same thing, but I didn't know. <laughs> oh, Ooh, our level. I don't know about that, Dad. Yo, whenever someone is killed, they get a gold? Holy. Oh, no. Oh, <laughs> well, that, was that for okay, both okay. sides? Or That's just, okay, just okay. for you. But uh, if a character is killed, if a character is killed on either side, you are the one that gains the gold. Good card. Good card. It's all right. It's all right. <laughs> and lastly, over the table, remember that April Fool's Day? Yeah, let's go. There you go. Yo, what pack Ooh. is that in? Uh, can you yeah. get that in any other pack? Because no, like, I need that pack, from bro. my. You, no, you know, Dad's got the hookup, bro. You know, those <laughs> it's one of one, one bro. Like, like I, band, need bro. That, I need that for my archetype. That's that's my deck right there. <laughs> we'll talk. We'll talk. Recall cards cost negative two allies for a man. He even goes into. <laughs> hmm. I, this is me. I know. I Because I, I got to. <laughs> I have to pick one. Uh, Dad, <laughs> Dad, is that it or like? <laughs> Heck, can I have all of them? <laughs> I'm your favorite yeah, like they're daughter, They're all here, right? bro. Like, Dad, why are we holding out on me? They're all here. You got them in your There's hand. only so much board. power he has. Yeah, but, like, hand me the car. I don't need you to do anything else. I don't, Mama's out here cheating, bro. Like, I need the hookup, you know? Damn. Believe in the heart of the cards. Trust your judgment. I'll maybe pick second floor. King of games. <laughs> <laughs> All right, meta gamers, we're gonna quick above the table. <laughs> meta pigeon here, like, <laughs> what, do you, what do, what do, like, give me a quick, like, I'm leaning towards second floor, Artlem. What do you think? I want to say second floor just because I don't know how many sex can, cards we're gonna can get. Can we just figure out how many? And cards there's definitely more. Like, we have real well, quick. Well, so that's what I'm saying. I think there's gonna be more recall card because there's some cards that overlap, right? That that right. are more than one mode. So sure. I think it's sa a safer bet to go with second floor because. Like, you know what I mean? Unless you're oh, pulling you enough stacks of cards to fill the deck out, like, that's, it's a, yeah. it's a risk reward. Um, cause that's a good the, card, but like. The only thing is the Artlum thing is like universal. That's my, I was my only thing. Believe in yourself. Well, <laughs> it, it, wait, the Artlum it, card wouldn't apply. It only would apply to. Choose the card. That it it my, applies to all I, characters. Same for all yeah, these I locations. Think, I think the second floor or secondary effect is still pretty good. Um, 
the Let's 11th see. floor is just very circumstantial. Let's, advantage. Advantage. Let's, Let's see. When dealing damage, deal damage before the opposing character. Oh, so we're immune to that. Okay, that's means So to clarify to advantage, because... if we were to say that the enemy character is a 3-3 and your character is a 3-3 and they have advantage, they deal the damage first, meaning your character dies, dies and right. does not and deal damage back to them. Yeah. yeah, yeah, right, right, basic. So, yeah. right, so any stalemates turn into a victory, a win for you, basically. Yeah. Um, plus allies? immune to effects of the enemy. Okay. Matt makes a good point. 11th floor also has effect of plus 999 to fish. I should have put that on the card, but that, is, that goes without saying, I think. Oh, that's that makes it Punching even better, bro. Yeah, yeah, we're right. not running a fish deck, so we ain't got to work. Okay. No, 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 no. I, I will when, when we actually play the game later. That's what all right, all right. Fish I'll play the game. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, my money's on second floor, personally, but... I go. I, I say second floor just because I don't think... You don't want to play the long game with yeah, the cards that we have. I just think it covers yeah. more cards. Like, it's gonna... You're gonna be able to get more utility out of it, but... I say Arlem because all your cards cost a ton of gold. Ooh. Mm. Mm, that's fair. Well, I mean, but with that doesn't necessarily mean we have to build a deck with a heavy gold cost you know what i mean no but you, just the cards we have well you plus we, you want to round ramp into it though we don't we also don't know how many more we're gonna get exactly well, that's what I, plus every build around what we have so you want to build yeah. to the most valuable resource that you can get and since gold is the summoning resource you want to hey, build towards that hey joe Me above yeah the table. what's up how many how many cards can you have in your deck, by the way? Fifty. I think it's fifty, right? Yeah. Fifty. Five zero. Holy! Yeah. You. Yeah, you we, don't, we don't even have enough cards to fill that. Right? Well, not yet. But... What's the minimum? What? I will say that the location oh, you true. the location is that is chosen you can have multiple copies. Um, you can have dupes it, if you wish. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Even yeah, though up to three. Yeah. But is there a minimum? Is there like a minimum that? for the deck? you god uh i would say no less than 40. so it's a 10. Let, okay. let's i'm gonna yeah, make okay. that call now where you have I mean, to have 40 cards minimum okay a 40 card deck and you can have up to max. fix it if you want yeah to. let's make that yeah. call okay okay and you can only have three of each card yep top three, yeah okay. three dupes or so it says Artlum card, co card costs negative two, negative two what? Resources. Uh, resource, yeah. So um, uh, yeah. if it was a gold, if it's... it was a character, it'd be minus two. To play Ace, I for think... example, Ace would cost one gold instead of three. Like oh. the base, yeah, yeah. yeah, the base, the base, base effect resource. is like very great if you have a lot of that type of card. Mm. Right? And then like the secondary well, effect of Artlum is goaded, so I get it, but like, you're you gonna play a long game with a, we don't even know like all the art loan cards we don't even know if, well so like, that that's my that's... reasoning for second floor is that of all the cards mm. that you were, we're gonna get in the pool to pick from you're gonna have more cards that are uh, that overlap uh that are recall cards than art loan cards or it's Dexa card because Dexa card that's just team Dexa. if you don't pull one right. of those cards or enough of it's them useless. to round out the deck you're not going to get much mm -hmm. utility out of it and you could the, the effect of art loan is good but again you have to get an art loan specific card to, yeah, to okay, like maximize okay. that card with that one there's not only team re there's the base team recall characters but there's also characters that overlap as in like they are you know one faction or they they you know double faction right. so they're something right. else and team recall so you get more okay. utility no All matter right. what you pull we gotta make All our right. choice it's still early make make a choice and we'll build around it <laughs> okay. that's fair that is fair yeah. like Eden's Eden's hand will like hover over the art loan one for a second and then she'll like you'll see like some something like Sigmund will see something like flash across her eyes and she'll grab the second floor. God, Ruka. Second floor. I just want to like, point out that. Did you just that... discount me? And since she goes, oh Ace would be God. half off. Badoom. Listen. I just listen. want to point out Ace is also an Artlum card, so she but would have been reduced to recall. plus one. Right, but she's also recall. So. I I picked second floor. I picked second floor. All right. That's where we were all happy. Hell yeah, brother. 
<laughs> we'll get all the, the recall cards we can. Uh, You're not getting any more recall cards. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I don't know why I said you I mean, I'm just We got Jong Eden. <laughs> Eden and we got Ace. So, <laughs> so Sigmund, awesome. sm Sigmund smiles as you take the card. And then he continues to walk as if he wants to hear more. But we're going to now cut to the boys. So, the boys. Uh, Jong's group, you're leaving the clock room, correct? Yeah. Is that what you wish to do? You're leaving the clock the room. I <laughs> start sniffing around, Jong. Let's see if you can find some cards. So We're hunting booster pack. <laughs> so when you leave the room, uh, this doesn't require a roll or anything. Uh, the first thing you notice is that you hear, uh, you, you 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 look over. So like if I if I kind of cut on roll twenty here to everybody, when you look over, the the group of you notices Damien and Hugo entering the piano room. There they go. Well, where's Hans? Says Ryobe. And and for that matter, where's Duke? Where's the Duke? Well, are we gonna? <laughs> what do we do? Well, I I don't really care, so I wouldn't say. Anything. <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. Does Jong? I mean, are you leading the way somewhere? Or are you just kind of gauging? Well, I'm room? trying to. I'm trying to. Because we just came. Hold on, wait. Am I in roll twenty? Yes. Yeah, so you came from so, this room here. I'm looking around. This, this room yeah, is this unexplored. One. This one. Okay. So I'm kind of thinking we go into this room. So Jong starts heading off that way. Well, I'm gonna like talk to the group. Okay. I'm okay. Just, sorry. I'm, walk. I'm just saying like that's my that's my that's your thinking. priority. That's okay. my thinking. Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> I mean, it I mean, is. If the goal is to gather cards, we. Do need more for the deck. And it might be better to try to cover as much ground in two groups as possible. Ryobe, if you want to, you can join the Damien group and maybe you'll find and we can all Yeah. We can all meet up at the end with whatever cards we got. We'll reconvene and discuss then. Okay, sounds good. Catch you guys later. That okay. Take a look at What's up, Wu? says Lonnie. Nothing. You've been awfully quiet. Just a little worried, that's all. But this should work out. You're right, John. Let's let's do it that way. All right. You all enter this room. I'm going to move you to a new place. Oh, I just showed too much. <laughs> And nobody paused. Oh, damn, there. I wasn't looking. Do it again. I don't think it's that much, but it's just, you know. Uh. All right. All of like the you know the kind of like the sort of atmosphere that was present in that previous room. It's like as soon as you enter this room, it's like a stark reality. And I will say too, you had to climb a flight of stairs once entering this hallway. Kind of like a spirally staircase, Linquist esque, as you then reach this little corridor of the second floor. And uh, I've moved you here. I'll go ahead and copy the uh, tokens as well. Oh, Ryobe, you're not there. And it's kind of like the, you know what? You know what the vibe is? The vibe is this. Vibe check, Joe, vibe check. This is the vibe. That's kind of what I was trying to describe. Oh, oh that's no. awful. I don't like that <laughs> vibe. That's awful. What you, what's wrong? Ew. on the fog of war but it's fine okay so when you enter this area a person greets you mm. hello i was gonna make a star wars reference why did i say it out loud um do it <laughs> do it do it oh my god he's here. give in to your wants and desires. hello friends hello friends and a man in a mask, and standing in front of this conspicuous wall, greets you. Does it look like Darth Vader's mask? And the man has a bag on his back. Oh, by the way, uh, there was a group that I didn't say this for, but paintings, you earned those heart frag. You, you, were, uh, you, uh, you earned the fragments. I sounded like a porky pig there. So four, four fragments total, two per group. 
And you notice that this man has a backpack on. Which, and there seems to be, like, various items, like potions, and, and even, like, a couple of small handheld weapons kind of jammed into the bag. And booster packs? How may Who's I help you today? Like, run up to, like, the back of his, of his bag and just kind of, like, poke around at it. Oh, oh, I, I see you're getting awfully friendly. What, uh, what are you doing here? And do, do you and Wu like shuffles with his inventory and pulls like this little like empty bottle out and he's like, Do you have any more of these? Oh, wait, empty what? It's like a little empty potion bottle. Oh. I'm afraid my potions would not work on you. Apologies. <sighs> Figured. What would your potions work on? I have, my potions are for my own purposes. Right now I'm working on a project, you see, and he looks back at the wall behind him. A little project that revolves around needing a certain substance, and I'm wondering if you fine travelers would happen to provide me with them. <laughs> that substance wouldn't happen to be a gem, would it? Very astute, and he holds out his hand. So what do we get for giving you these gems? Well, I don't know. And he pulls off his backpack. Like I said, the potions wouldn't work. You already have fine weapons. How about... And then he flashes a booster pack. Let's get talk, them credit cards. <laughs> hold, on, hold, on, hold on, hold on, hold on. How many of those do you have? How many fragments can you bring me? And he smiles. Oh, say less. We'll be back. You can't really see this smile, but. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Before we go, how many gems do you want for one pack? For now, I believe one gem per pack will suffice. However, these gemstones are quite valuable to me. And so I will provide you with the booster pack of your choice. If you would like action cards per se i would be more than happy to give you a booster pack tailored towards action cards but if character cards are more to your liking i would be more than happy to provide as well there aren't many item cards and so item cards don't really have booster packs say eh? they're acquired differently usually what do you mean by acquired differently you'll have to explore the rest of the mansion to find out my friend i'm not the Wait, only can, one with cards can you provide booster packs of a specific archetype by any chance a specific archetype could you provide an example you mean faction yes 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 as they call it. Ooh, i'm afraid that is not where my area of expertise lies you may however find something similar throughout the mansion okay fair I'm enough to do some looking around so one gem per pack yes for now no. If you happen to provide me with every single missing fragment, why, I would be happy to give you an additional reward. Hmm. We'll keep it in what? Excellent. Would you like to trade now? No, we're good. We're going to talk and reconvene. One other thing, and he points across the room, and you see there's a locked gate. If you happen to find the key to that gate, you might find something behind it that I think you'd find pretty useful. Also, any points down the hall? Are you good at riddles? <laughs> and Lani just like <laughs> puts her head in her face. Her head in her face. That's exactly what she does. She puts her head yep. in her face. Yep. <laughs> sure do. <laughs> oh, Lani, no! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Why sure, uh, I used to be anyway. To, what is it? <laughs> Once upon a time. <laughs> Long ago. <laughs> anyway, thank you for talking. It's been nice chatting with you. So what now, Sushion? We go hunting. Yeah, I think it would be smart to wait until we reconvene with the other team before we talk about spending gems, because I'm sure they have a pretty good collection themselves. 
We pull together all our resources and see what we can buy. For now, let's see if we can get any more of these packs. Yeah. Don't you think we should? You don't want to get more? More what? More. More gems. Oh, I do, but I just figured Damien's group's got to already have some, so rather than just spend what we have now, let's see what we have in total, because he said if we give him all no, the I gems... No, get, I get you. Okay. All right, well, let's uh, keep on hunting, I guess. Okay, so where do you head now? Uh, well, we just... The left is where we came from, correct? Like uh, came... you came from south, south, actually. Oh, south. Yes. Oh, sorry, hold on. It's blocked on my screen. I didn't see that. Yeah. Um... Okay, I guess we should go north then. Mm-hmm. Okay, no. Potentially. I I kind of want to check out the riddle that he was talking about. Oh, is, well, isn't that yeah? Isn't that that is north? Is yeah. It is oh, north. okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then yeah, that's yeah, we're good. We're good. <laughs> so unlike the previous riddle, you're not locked in the room. You're not forced to to do anything here. But you do see it's 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 similar in some ways to the last room you were in, but but different in others. Four pedestals, four sort of uh, pressure pit plates line the ground, and these pressure plates are very, eh, I cannot talk today. These p pressure plates are very sensitive, and so well, if Lonnie, for example, steps on one, you notice it kind of shifts depending on exactly where she's standing uh, on the tile. Um, but regardless, you see there's a note posted at the very end of the room. I'll read it. Woo, you go forward to read the note. Oh, oops. Feel free to look on my screen here. The bearer of the northern light stood watching it, his back outlined against the stern of the waves. And as the setting sun was blocked by the fish staring southward, the eastern animal tamer gazed from afar at its shining scales. Well, solve the puzzle. Come on. Is this in images? So yeah, um, if you scroll up to uh, last week, where I said no uh -huh. peeking, the, the the riddle from last week is there, and then below it is this one. I see. So. I reacted to it by pointing oh, out that. Thank everything. you. Okay. Ah. Uh... Hold up, quick question real quick about the tape before we we'll go. Um, is Lonnie a, Lonnie's a scout, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. ah. If you want to, I can cut away to the Damien group and give you guys a minute. This is one of those cases where I think I have the answer, but I think we don't have the people here for it. Ah, okay. Mm. Yeah, I'll take a while. I'll cut away. I'll give you guys a minute and we'll cut back and see if you have an answer. Ooh, I'm leaking again. Leaking some images. Okay. Damien. Yes. I'm going to move you to a new room here. And... Hugo and you, you, you go searching for the Duke and Hans. You go to see if you can find your dear old friends uh, as, as you seem to think they're in the ballroom. The ballroom is filled with people laughing and having a grand old time. And they seem to be a, a little perplexed, however. They're kind of like looking over, but trying to kind of enjoy their time regardless. Because... They're looking over at the walls are across the room it has a giant crater inside of it and there's like rubble everywhere on the other side of the room and you see oh someone dropped yeah. I, isaiah isaiah's gone 
May he rest in peace. No! It's okay. It's okay. He hates riddles anyway. All right, so Milios, you're Jong. Son, you're Brack. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, okay. And, and you know, other Joe and I will just tag team uh, how woo. Like we'll we'll be both woo because we're both. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, <laughs> you'll go back and forth for sure, for sure. Okay. I want to summon Mizaru. Like Gollum. <laughs> no, summon Mizaru. You will. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Isaiah texted me. My power just went out. Oh. Oh, dude. oh boy. All brutal. Happy episode 80, by the way, guys. <laughs> if it isn't OBS, it's the power. <laughs> Damn. Okay. Hang in there. <laughs> Hang in there, Isaiah. Uh, meanwhile. Milios has you covered. <laughs> that's true. Well, I'll cut to you. You know, it's uh, John number two in a minute. Oh. He's back! Oh, hey, he's oh back. my god! That came back quick. Oh my god. Woo! It just came back on that's Crazy. Let's go. That's fun. Let's go. All right. Episode saved. Thank God. Okay. Welcome back, Isaiah. We missed you. Okay. Thank you. So, uh, Damien and Hugo, you enter the room and you see Duke in front of the crater in the wall. So if I'm pinging here, this wall is just like there's a massive crater and rubble everywhere. And Duke is in front of somebody on the ground. Uh, yes. Uh, let us go, Hugo. We must make sure that Hans is okay. The two of you walk over to Hans to find that he is not looking good. Uh, oh, bleeding everywhere, basically, and he's unconscious. Ragdolling while Duke is like holding him up. And he's Rag got like a. Ragdolling? Oh. <laughs> I don't know. I'm, I'm, Limp. Limp, limp. limp is the non-gamer terminology, I suppose, where it's like his his whole body is he's un, he's clearly not conscious, and he's got a big gash in his head. Oh lord! So he's just bleeding everywhere. Yeah. All right. And you can see uh, that Duke is doing something with his fingers. Okay. Uh, is there anything that you haven't done yet, Duke? He looks up at you. Who did this to him? That would be the big lady. The big lady. She picked me up, and I guess Hans, he, he jumped on board with me to save me. I saw the hand, and then I saw yeah. Hans fly right by me. Yeah, uh, we are in a bit of a pickle, but let's try and save Hans first. You're saying that this big lady can we fight her? It's part of Eden's purification. I mean, you heard the announcement, right? If Aki gets revenge, Aki's in the Band of Bones, same thing. I'm not sure. He looks back down. I'm doing what I can. And you can see some of, like, you can't even see how, but some of Hans's wounds are, like, kind of getting closed oh, by an invisible good. substance. Uh, Hans, uh, are you in any? Oh yeah, you're you're clearly in pain. Uh, let's get the alcohol, Hugo. He looks at you confused. This it's a. It might numb the pain. We can probably use it to clean some wounds. He nods and then heads off to the piano room. And then you hear giggling. Giggling. Some of the ballroom dancers and people partaking of the fine food and drink are looking over at the four of you and just covering their masks and giggling. Okay, I'm going to ignore them and uh, see what I can do for Hans. Go ahead and roll medicine. Or if you'd like to do something else, by all means. I, I'm like kind of shocked how good my medicine is. Okay. I was going to say I'm not very good at medicine, but... <laughs> he just assumed. <laughs> yeah, okay, well, I, I got a seven. Uh, seven. 
it seems as though Duke is doing a pretty good job of, of, of doing what he can to close the wounds. So on your part, you know, you're just I, assisting I, him with that, basically. Yeah, I, I, I for some reason, uh -huh. I instinctively made a Molotov cocktail. Okay. Wow, okay. Yep, yep. What? Just like on I'm the second floor. I'm sh yeah, good times. Today's the nostalgia episode. So yeah, okay, you make a Molotov cocktail. All right, that didn't help. Duke just like gives you a look and then goes back to what he was doing. Uh, but Hugo returns with the uh, alcohol. It's a bottle of wine. And he ah, hands it to uh, you. Okay, is is Hans conscious? Can you talk? Nope. Oh gosh, maybe this will numb the pain. Can I have a second opinion, Doctor Doctor Bones. It's Doctor Duke. Show some respect. Yeah, sorry, I didn't know that you were a doctor <laughs> until now, but. Do you think he Anyone who claims that they're a doctor when they're not... Dude, I'm just trying to help. Scumbags in my eyes. I, you yeah. just... You literally just did that! Oh my god, whatever. I've learned a thing or two about medicine in my time. Let me roll. Apparently I did too. <laughs> does, 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 does he need anything? He needs rest. Alright. But he, he just... takes the alcohol... And then throws it back himself, taking a gulp. If he wakes up, we can give him some. All right. I guess, can I leave him in your care? We you want to take him close to the fireplace? That's right here. And then Hugo taps you on the shoulder, Damien. Oh, what's up, Hugo? He points to the giggling ballroom dancers. Okay, what's your deal? What what is so funny? <laughs> is it me? Am I the funny one? And okay, I'm gonna walk up to these, oh. these people giggling. Okay. Alright. <laughs> Care to explain what's so funny? You all look so funny. <laughs> You want to play with us? It sounds like we'd have a lot of fun if we played together. I, uh, I need to make sure my friend is okay before I play any games. No, 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 no. You'll play with us now. I, uh, think we can wait a little bit before we play. And they start taking off their masks. Oh. And when each one takes off the mask... It is, the rest of their body is pristine, but when they take off that mask, imagine the creepiest, in the trash, doll head. That's what you see. All right. The porcelain, okay. the eyes glinting, oh, yeah. staring yeah. at you. Yeah, all right. I light the Molotov talk cocktail <laughs> in my hand, and okay. I lift it over my head. <laughs> okay. What are you gonna do? What do you wanna do? I, I need you to roll initiative. What do you want to do? <laughs> I need you to roll initiative, Damien. Would you like to attempt to throw it at them before initiative starts, uh -huh. or what's your what's? No, no I'm gonna see. I'm gonna see. What are they gonna do? Nineteen. I'm oh, I see. Nineteen initiative. All right, all right, all right. Give me a minute to kind of paint the you know fill the. I would like to be. Here. I would like to be able to react. Like if they yeah, start yeah, yeah, like yeah. doing oh. anything spooky. All right. Mm -hmm. They do anything really weird, like you know, like stretch out their face at me. Yeah. All right. That that Molotov is is going right on them on this nice carpet. Okay. Understood. I'm really glad I accidentally made that Molotov. Now <laughs> it's, it might work out. All right. We got this. All right. Let me just do a couple more here. All right. We're going to go with this. The first to act are a couple of the dolls who rolled natural 20. So you kind of pull back the Molotov cocktail. Although you said you wanted a reaction, you say. So, so can you explain a little bit, like before initiative starts, you want to chuck this? Huh? Like, like, I, I, I like, all right. You know, you know, in South Park, Randy Marsh takes his shirt off. He's like, what do you want to do? 
<laughs> okay. What do you want to do? He's, I, he's waiting. Okay. He's waiting for the next move okay. to happen. Okay, you know? sure, sure. You know, he's looking around. He's scooping out, you know, these targets. All right, this right. is a lot more dull than I thought. <laughs> yeah. Oh, God. Uh-huh, uh-huh. But you're yeah, just I'm waiting good. for your turn to come, essentially. I'm, I'm, I'm basically, it's, I'm, 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 I'm like set up, you know? Like, I don't know. Like, oh, think no. of it like suppressing fire or something. I understand. Or not suppressing fire, but like. You're prepared. Yeah, okay. Isaiah dropped again. Like, I, I have drawn a line in the ground, and if you cross this line, you are getting fire. Okay, they uh, charge at you anyway. That's going to be a 16 to hit. That hits. All righty. So I'm, I'm healed up from the thing, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thing, right? Full okay, health. Okay, okay. Yep. Yeah. For sure. I, right. I thought I was, but I just wanted to make sure. Go ahead and take four I'm... slashing damage as their nails dig into your skin. Okay. All right. That's it? Nope, because then this one's also going to attack you. Okay, fine. That's it. It's going to be a 19. That hits. Nine damage as this one digs into your skin. All right. You know what? <laughs> okay, sorry, continue. continue. It's your turn. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right. This is how today's going to go, I guess. <laughs> I throw the Molokov top tail right on the, right on the <laughs> ground in front of this this thing here like right okay yep for sure you don't have to roll uh to throw it on the ground do you like run backwards as you do it mm -hmm. it's kind of like you know hopping away okay um, well, you know, i'm gonna shift shift around you know i'm gonna you know shift around you know like i'm gonna throw it and be like haha idiot and then walk over here <laughs> okay all right all right perfect so the ground the carpet lights on fire and uh, they they kind of immediately start to react and try to hop away from the flames. So the carpet is now on fire. You're really good at that, at, do, at setting carpets on fire. Yeah, it's like a skill I have. Or something. <laughs> you, you'd be proficient in it. Do you do anything else? <laughs> huh? Um, that that counts as an action, right? So I don't I don't yeah. have anything else. Okay, okay, that that sounds good. I, I I don't think. No, I don't. Okay, and my turn. Sure. Okay. So then uh, some of these dolls are going to start to move. But first, they take fire damage here. Oh, my God. Max damage. Cool. Yep. You know, it's just one of those. This days. doll just goes up in flames. <laughs> and I warned them. I did. I <laughs> this warned doll them. just I warned them. immediately goes up in flames. But... Creepy dolls... I don't care. When just, just call me, just call me. <laughs> when the doll goes, call me Damien Eric Belmont Frog. <laughs> okay, okay. When the doll goes up in flames, uh, you notice something kind of fall out of it. Can you roll uh, perception? Don't say it's a. Do not say it's a booster pack. Go ahead and roll perception. All right, here we go. Uh, twenty-one. Uh, a card falls out of the puppet onto okay, the yeah. ground. All right. I hope uh, these cards are fireproof. In the flames. All right. We're going to be waiting for those to, this fire to, to come out. Welcome back, Isaiah. Hey. The, the hero Yay! returns. I may have griefed a little bit <laughs> since you were gone. He's not even but, thinking. Uh, we'll, find, think we'll find out. Welcome back, Isaiah. It's good to have you back for the second time. You are muted. Was sure. the power going out again? Or... Yeah, I don't know what's weird. Is it, like there's no storm going on, but like the, mm -hmm. all the power is just like dry. It'll it'll yeah it's all going out, but then like it comes back on, and Jeez. I don't really know what's going on. Okay, no, problem, no problem. Nothing I can really do about it. Yeah, no worries, no worries. Um, okay, so yeah, the card falls onto the ground from inside the puppet. Okay, this one's gonna charge forward. It still takes some damage. Oh my God. And then this one's going to move towards Hugo and attack Hugo. And it definitely hits. Well, thank you for existing, Hugo. Ooh, Hugo takes uh, a lot of damage from that. He kind of like, tries to block with his arms, but now his arms are like cut up and bleeding. All right, Hugo, hypothetically, how much damage would you say that was on a scale of like 1 to 12? I'd give it a 10. All right. Thanks, Hugo. Okay. It's I now to strategize around that. It's now Hugo's turn. And 
As if just reacting to the doll in front of him, he just takes the doll and like tries to slam it into the ground. Okay. Let me go ahead and roll. Uh, but unfortunately, the, these dolls are agile. The doll hops off of the carpet, out of the fire, and out of harm's way. So Hugo tries to keep the doll from you, Damien. He stands in front of it between you two. Well done. Good job. It is the Duke's turn. Explore. Well, thanks a lot, Damien. Now I can't go fight them because of all these flames. What do you mean? You're a wave controller. And? I prefer to use fight your... up close and personal. Use your waves. <laughs> My Shinsu is a bit special, let's say. Oh, yeah, we all... I don't... Aren't we all special? <laughs> it's not... <laughs> all right, fine. I mean... There are basic fundamentals, hey, frog, don't you know? I lost my puppet. You want to be my puppet? Wait a second. Just relax. Relax oh, your body. God. And you feel oh, this you, yo. you feel this sensation crawl up your spine. Do you want Duke to oh. take over? Oh. Yeah, sure, fine. <laughs> wow! So, already in the flames, he takes your gauntlet and just punches forward as hard as he can. And you hit the puppet right in front of you. Yeah. Uh, yeah, you hit it for some damage, not a ton, but you deal a bit of damage, for sure. And then he <laughs> yanks you back out of the flames. Oh. And then releases control. All right, that was good. Well done. You're the first one to let me do that. Yeah. Well. Pretty awesome, right? Little... Yeah, I, 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 we've built up a little bit of trust there. That, yep. <laughs> Okay. Let me just, you know, I'm just doing a little I'm bit of calculations in my brain. Have you let him, like, control your body? Yes! Yeah. Okay, oh, okay, yes. okay. I'm sorry. I, I had forgotten that detail. I forgot. He forgets about women with muscles. It's fine. The, the, they're inconsequential, right? Yeah. So technically, these two dolls... <laughs> I'm kidding. Wu, <laughs> Wu took that personally. <laughs> I like William's like, <laughs> head shake. He's just like, I'm so disappointed. <laughs> All right, the uh, the two dolls on the edge hey, there. Dude, before you end your turn, do you think you can like step back a little bit? He steps back a little bit. The Just, uh, you know, a little bit more, maybe drag drag Hans a little bit. He does not drag Hans. All right. Okay, well you know that's good enough, I guess. The two dolls on the edge take some fire damage. Okay, before they run off of the carpet and they run over to the drinks and they start to like guzzle the drinks. Okay, that's a little weird. Uh, Just into their gaping mouths, you know. <laughs> okay. I had to add that detail. So now this doll is gonna take some damage. Doesn't that make them like more? <laughs> like, are they gonna burn even more now? <laughs> Don't add. You'll see. I, these are special dolls. Okay. Uh, we'll, <laughs> we'll we'll see. We'll see. All right. He takes okay. some the doll I... takes damage before charging at you. As a nat one, uh, it, it runs into the wall and misses you entirely. Ooh. Yeah, I use my Alucard backdash. Yeah. Now this Dodge. this doll is gonna take some fire damage. Alrighty, and it's gonna attack Hugo with advantage from flanking. It hits, and Hugo gets clawed from behind. Also advantage on that because they're flanking. Uh, that's what I said. Yeah, yeah, thank you, thank you. Um. Oh, okay. Damien. Yeah. Uh, that would have been a twelve on the scale. And oh, like Jesus. his 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 shirt is like mm. ripped, and there's like a huge gash in his back now that is deeply bleeding, just like yeah pouring. All right. Your turn. It is my turn. Um. Let me just, uh, you know, I've got tons of movement. All right, I'm gonna stop this whole flanking business. I'm gonna walk up to the, uh, well, not walk up, but all right, yep. this this one, I just, you know, like, haha, you missed. <laughs> I'm gonna go 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 right over to this one. I'm just gonna slash it with the, with my, use my gauntlet of the golden god. So me slash it? No, I just hit it. Oh, okay, okay. Gauntlet of the golden god that hits. Uh, four damage. Four damage. Let's go. Anything else? Um, it didn't die, did it? No. 
Ignite. Ignite! Ignite! The gauntlet begins to glow. Ignite! Okay, what do you do? I uh, ignite my weapon. It's, it, it deals an extra plus five, I think. Plus uh, five? Is it plus wisdom or, I mean, uh, charisma or what? Plus, plus wisdom. Plus wisdom. And you have plus five on wisdom? Yeah. Yeah. Can you describe the attack? Yeah, so I I hit it with my gauntlet. Okay. All right. And the ling the lingering, right Shinsu there. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Well, for the, the, the gauntlet, like you know, it, it's it's almost it's almost like my hand is is flat, right? Yeah. It's almost like a sword, right? So I'm slashing with the hand. Uh huh. And then I ignite the weapon, and the lingering Shinsu from the slash makes the target explode with radiant damage. As soon as you hit the puppet pieces of it, the fluff, the eyes pff, just go everywhere. And the yeah, only thing that remains... You guys weren't ready to play with Damien Frog! <laughs> the old... Damien Eric Frog! I thought it was Damien Eric Belmont Frog. It is today. Today. Damien Everything explodes Eric-ish. except the one card that falls to the ground. I did something weird Can there. I very coolly catch the card? Like, as it's oh, late. Oh, absolutely. But the card is, it's, uh, we'll be able to check out what it is uh, pretty soon here. All right. Yeah, catch it with two fingers. The ungauleted hand catches it with two fingers. Sick. Sick, bro. Uh, yes. Okay. So, so sick, I'm throwing up all over the floor, bro. Okay. This doll is dead, so I'm going to cross that out. Oh, wait. There we go. Uh, How many dolls do I have here? One, that one, that one, that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so now this doll is gonna take some damage. Okay. And it's gonna also attack Hugo. While giggling, by the way, I feel like it's an important detail. It gets advantage, good, because it rolled in that one. But it still misses. Hugo's able to fend off this, this, this third puppet that appeared out of nowhere. Very good, Hugo, very good. Okay, and now this puppet is going to attempt to attack Hans, but I'm going to say that Duke is within the vicinity where he's able to, he's kind of shielding uh, Hans, and so the attack is going to be directed at Duke instead, and it is going to hit. Oh, God damn it! Okay. He takes uh, a lot of slashing. Once again, his arms as he's blocking over Hans's body. It's Hugo's turn! And this time, he summons his inventory and grabs his hammer and slams the ground. Uh, but then he looks behind. I'm sorry, Damien. It's okay. All right, make a deck save. All right, here we go. The Damien Eric Frog deck save. Seven. Okay, all three of you fail. That's good. Though, as right? the as the marble just like explodes around you. Oh. Oh. <laughs> uh, you only take three damage. Three. Okay. Oh. This one. But the one that is right here, uh, this 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 sort of go- uh, this puppet here explodes, leaving a card on the ground. Okay, Hugo. Okay. I'm sorry I about see that. you like to explode things too. No, no, it's good. We're not the same. What? <laughs> it's Duke's turn. Oh, shit. <laughs> Duke is going to punch the puppet and miss. Nice job, Duke. Okay, um, so now it's these two. This one goes for a drink. And then this one. The normally soulless eyes are glowing red as it runs across the room and tries to tackle you to the ground, Damien. Hey, you just went crimson head on me? Okay, I need you right. to make either athletics or acrobatics check. Um, let's do athletics. Uh, 22. Okay, uh, it tries to tackle you to the ground, but you kind of like slide back and you're able to fend it off no problem. Like Alucard, right? I, yes, exactly like Alucard. <laughs> it's your turn. All right. Well, 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 Mr. Crimson Head. Assuming that you have the, uh... All right. The carpet's still on fire, yes? Yep. And this thing just consumed a bunch of, of drink that is definitely alcohol. Yes. Right? Hugo, can you confirm to me that that's alcohol? Yeah, I believe so. 
Uh, very good, very good. All right. <laughs> All right. Time for Operation Baseball Strat 3.0. <laughs> it's got to be 6.0 at this point. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to attempt to throw the puppet into the fire. Okay. So like a, like a grapple into throw yeah. kind of deal. Okay, make yes. an athletics check. A 13. The puppet squirms out of your grasp. Okay, all right, you squirmy puppet. I didn't have any... I didn't I didn't have a clever thing to say after that. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Um, is that an action or a bonus action? That's an action. Uh, so I can't lighthouse do my fool? Um... You, is it a bonus action to do that? Um, I don't think so. Okay. I'll just, yeah, I'll just say my turn. Okay, okay. Um, let me see. So, okay, this one's going to attack Hugo once again, no longer with advantage. Is going to miss. And then this one's going to attack Duke again. But is going to hit. Duke takes more slashing damage. Honestly, Duke and Hugo have taken quite... A fair amount of damage from these dancing uh, puppets. I took a lot of damage too. They've taken a little more than you, but yes, you've taken a lot as well. Not, I don't mean, I don't mean to sell yourself short. It's sell you short. I'm sorry. Okay, it is Hugo's turn. He's gonna smack the puppet right in front of him, who also should take some fire damage as well. And the combination of the two, the fire damage, the hammer smashes it into the ground, leaving nothing behind but a card. Okay, it is Duke's well, well turn. Done. Well done, Hugo. I w he can, you can hear him mumbling out loud. I know Hans isn't exactly feeling good, but could I still control his body? I can't. Too unpredictable. You can tell he was thinking about using the unconscious Hans to attack this, but instead, he'll punch it in the face, and it will hit. It will hit. So he'll deal some damage here. Enough that when he hits the doll, it's enough to kill it as it rams into the wall. Say it explodes, Joe. It explodes against the wall. Yeah. Pieces going everywhere. Good, Duke. Good. <laughs> this doll has a, the biggest grin you've ever seen, and it's going to tackle you and attempt to charge into the flames with you so that it can explode alongside right. of you. I think I've I've learned something. Let me, let me just remember mm. use my memory of mm -hmm. when Fon von Sycamore uh, kind of dodged my tackle attempt, and see oh. if I can execute a similar technique. Okay, yeah. Go ahead and make uh, make an athletics check with uh, with advantage. I'll give you some inspiration there. Oh my god, with advantage. Yeah, that's awesome, advantage. dude. The callback. Oh well, <laughs> I don't think you needed it. I don't think so. But I'll roll. Okay. It attempts to charge into you, but with your perfect dirty 20 roll, you step aside, remembering the fight against Fawn, and the doll instead charges right into the flames, alcohol within its within its body, and explodes. I, I want to I wanna be able to, like... John yeah. Cena, like, do the fireman carry throw, you know? Oh, okay, okay. Do the attitude, do the attitude adjustment Just into like, the fire. Yeah, yeah, I like that. Absolutely, absolutely. And the only remaining doll, eyes flashing red, charges towards you all. Let me oh, check. Good. I thought he was. A, I looked into his eyes and I thought he was a runner. Not quite there, though. Your turn, Damien. Well, well, well. Looks like the turntables have turned for the turniest turn last time. I'm gonna, I'm gonna attempt to, I'm just gonna make a basic attack. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. And hopefully ignite. That hits. Okay. okay. Yep. Five damage and ignite again. So ten damage. Beautiful. And immediately following your attack, Hugo swings from behind. Just like, you know, imagine oh, like Tower of God. Imagine like Curdan in season one. He just oh like, my God. his we eyes have, glinting. We have, combo, we have a combo attack. And he's striking from behind. 
and the two of you together just like hammer punch hammer punch just like this puppet gets beat into smithereens congratulations all the dolls have been destroyed and as the fire starts to dim down and the carpet kind of wisps into nothingness a total of seven cards remain on the field glinting and calling you to pick them up are you guys okay <sighs> hugo's like checking his wounds and duke says Psh, this is nothing hey uh and then ryobe enters the room what did i miss oh hey what? you missed the party hans hans are you okay can i use my ice to to try and put out the fire yeah the let's, absolutely. you know just like you know just i'm crouched down <laughs> It's just like, like you know, <laughs> one little like flame a little, at a time, <laughs> a little, little tiny, okay. a little tiny ice, just trying to ignite to, to sure, sure. Put during the oh man, there's a lot of fire. Yeah, you, you're able to assist in the process, but the carpet was thin enough that like once the fire hits the marble, it doesn't spread. You know, uh, excellent, very good. Hans is Duke. okay. Don't worry about it. Yeah, Duke. And Hugo, you've earned this. I throw them the bottle of alcohol. Just put that on your arm. Disinfect your arm. Don't let it bleed too much. It's going to hurt, though. What do you take me for? And he pours the alcohol into his wounds. And he tanks it. He takes it like a champ. He tanks it. He, he tanks, tanks it. He tanks it. This tanky tanks, wave controller. At alcohol is nothing. That's and they're good. able to... I hopefully, they're not bleeding anymore. You're able to help stem the bleeding. With because of the alcohol, because of your timely intervention. Bro, this is a Resident Evil 7. You don't just like pour alcohol on your wounds and then it just heals people. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, it's not even the craziest thing they've done this episode. <laughs> Incorrect, but not do the it. craziest. Do the thing. They both with my do it. five medicine. <laughs> All right. Um, uh, Ryobe, want to help me collect some cards? Hans. Hey, buddy, say something. Hans! He's stable. He didn't take any damage. How did he end up like this? A giant woman that we're going to get revenge on later. Or should I say Aki is going to take down a notch? Yeah, pretty much what do you A say. giant woman? What? And he didn't... Hugo I steps down, there. steeps down and starts to pick up the cards. Very good. Let's just pick up these cards real quick. And he... While Hans being okay it would be great, we need to get out of this purification. And he he hands you the cards, Damien, as if giving you the honors. Oh, I mean, I mean, are you sure? I mean, he nods. It's a lot of fun. Okay, all right. So it's seven cards total. Seven cards total. Four of them. So it's not a... Hmm? Oh, man. Eh, sorry. Go ahead. Okay. So four of them, I'm not going to give you one through 100. Okay. So for the first four, I'm going to say roll one through 50, if that's possible. I think it should be possible on roll 20 to do that. Uh, <laughs> yeah, one through just, 50? You just do uh, uh, one D 50. 50. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, let's try it. Hey, just answer when I'm at the um, you 1d50. 1d50, thank you, thank you. Uh, 45. 45! Thank you. How many, am I, how many of these d50s am I rolling? Uh, you're gonna roll three more. Three thank more? You. Yeah, thank you, thank you. You said 45? Uh, yeah, 45. Uh, I mean, I, I'm cool with using Brax roll. Okay, okay. Brack, Brack from the other side is able to pitch in here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bra do do one more Milius. <laughs> I don't want to do all. I don't. I don't want to roll for cards all the time. Yes. As fun as it is. Okay, okay. So 45, 50, 22, 34. So 45 is the first one. So that means we need 19 on here. Okay. So the first card you acquire. Uh, these Mom, first four are action cards. The first one you acquire is... Uh-oh, frick. I was not supposed to drag it. I always do that. Give me just a second. 
Yes, here it is. <laughs> Ain't no way. <laughs> what Ain't in the no world? <laughs> Hold on a second. These two have never been in the same room together. Hey, no way. <laughs> Duke, do you know this man? Never seen him before in my life. Huh. He looks weak, though. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Bitch, I'm coming for you. Oh, shoot. I was about to say, Hammond needs to say something. <laughs> Duke, you don't understand what you just said. You just made an enemy of a fan base. <laughs> oh, my God. We can't look yeah, at the cardigan. Look, card again, so look, look at look how oh, weak you are in that picture, huh, Duke? <laughs> look how tiny your muscles are. Maybe you'll find yourself attractive. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Chill, Anna. <laughs> My God. Get him, Anna. Get him. Oh, oh, There's a whole fan base. That's the, you don't understand what you've done, Duke. <laughs> I like you, but you're not making any friends with that guy. I love your okay. art, Hercules. This is not a slight to you. It's just a slight to the Duke because he's <laughs> being extra today. Uh, so, if I'm understanding this correctly, a character can, you're basically giving a character charge or you, know, uh, like a, you, you, you can initiative. Right, you could do you could use it that way, or like sponge. Like he rests to gain shins. You know, this wouldn't be very useful there. But let's say they attack already. You could use this, and they could attack again. You know, there's multiple oh, uh, multiple uses. Okay. Oh, top tier card. That's the that's two mana wind fury. Okay. All right. <laughs> next card. I love it. What was the next number? Uh, fifty. Oh, all right. And you say Brack rolled this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, wow. Really I don't want I don't want to roll everything. Shoot, you know I, I mean? always do that. Uh there'll be two cards. Don't worry about it. No, I understand. Uh, All right, Amelius. here we go. 50. What does 50 get us? Oh. Hey, look at that. <laughs> that worked out. <laughs> oh, it's a search. It's a search. That's pretty good too. That's a good one as well. Five oh, cost. Ignore that. So it has to. It's it's five cost or high. Okay. 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 All right. Situational. I like it. It's not bad. You use it on the fourth turn. Get a five cost on the next turn. You know. Or I don't know. Like you can use it on the like second turn, maybe depending on the. Right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Depends on the resource dice and such. Mm -hmm. What's the next roll? Um. 22. 22, so that's gonna be in here. Oh! All right, what? the next one what you the... roll. Did oh I just boy. get pure, pure murder card? <gasps> oh, look at us. All, all God, yeah, ally cost. recall car characters gain <laughs> plus three, plus three, plus three. Well, that's quite good. Kind of looks like we made the right choice after all. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> big money, big money, baby! <laughs> cool. It's feasibly a plus 15 to value. For eight, though. That's expensive. Might be good. Mm, mm, interesting, interesting. And that's eight Shinsu, right? It is indeed. Eight Shinsu. All right, come on, counterspell. Come on, <laughs> come on. What's the next number? 34. Uh, 34. 26. All right. The next one is, and none of these are hollow. I'm sorry. Whoops. Oh. Oh, it's, it's youth. Youthful Brewmaster, the card, the item. <laughs> okay. Very good. This would have worked really good with that Stexa card. Mm -hmm. uh, team Stexa card, yeah. It's going in my personal deck, though. <laughs> <laughs> oh, That's half boy. as busted as the actual Gord is. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so this isn't a withdraw. This is just a return to your owner's, owner's hand, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, so that's really good. That's an excellent card. Okay. All right. So now these next three... One through 100. Oh boy. One through 100. Just like the good old days from earlier today. <laughs> wanna, wanna roll one with me, son? Wanna roll one, Milios? 
Damien, Damien the card master from episode six is getting all the, all the cards. Right, you go. I got one thirty-three. <laughs> I got thirteen. Uh, you're you're oh, rolling D. Milios, make sure you roll D one hundreds. Yeah, what's the command again? Oh, D one hundreds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, okay, but who, who's gonna roll one? There we go. R and then space D one hundred. We got it. We got it. And then the Wu's gonna roll one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, what are you saying again? So forward slash uh -huh. R space and then one D uh, in this case, a hundred. Okay, perfect. So what's the first roll? Uh, 13 on Friday the 13th. <laughs> all right. Who is the 13th character? Let's see. Oh, all right. Break me. I do it every it time. Tier. Sorry. I, I got to learn how to do that. All right. Is it tier Seth? It's tier Seth, isn't it? Butterscotch. That... Butters! Butters! Oh, butters! Butters! That's pretty good. Butterscotch. That would be a solid card in Hearthstone. Yeah, I'll make it. <laughs> Ooh, it's very <laughs> hard. Very <laughs> hard to <laughs> please me. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> okay, never mind. <laughs> All right, cool, cool. Next one? Uh, 36. This 36. is the old Milios roll. You said 36. 36. All righty. Who is that? Ooh, there we go. Uh, Baborios. Oh, gross. Okay. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> Hannah, chill. <laughs> oh my God. Actually, that's <laughs> like so... all the way home. Hey, um, yeah. Cheap calls, oh. two, two. Worth yeah. two and gives a plus one to spear bears. Yeah, solid. Light bear too. He's kind of mid. He's kind of. Mid. <laughs> yeah, it's nothing crazy, but like, <laughs> it's not bad. It's just. It's yeah, I high. mean, like, he's high. again, if your deck was built with him, like, you can make, you know, it would work. But uh, if you're running a spear bear deck, that, yeah, that's what I'm saying. If your plan is that, yeah, yeah, yeah. The Hoborios, uh, Orichasa combo though. Ooh, Bro, David's it's still on the Orishasa <laughs> train. Let's go. <laughs> uh, the next one is yes. Sun's Roll 21. 21. Uh, let me see. 21. I'm actually going to have you reroll that one. Oh. Sorry. I already what? forgot the command for slash. Uh, there's a reason. Uh, forward slash R space 1D100. You could just hit up on the keyboard and it'll uh, pull up the last macro. Uh, yeah, Zen yeah, martial artist, fine. you are so right. Thank you for, thank you. <clears throat> You're so right. Sorry, I'm reading, I'm just, Herborios did come in clutch. Okay. Did he? None of these are hollow. Uh, None <laughs> of them are hollow, I'm sorry. All right, that's fine. 93. Trash, bro. 93, the final card is. Here we go. There it is. There it is. Oh, oh God. No. God. No. Oh, no. <laughs> no. Wait, 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 wait. I you know, why, it. why does he have such a long description? Yeah, why he got all <laughs> this ish going on under his car, bro? Why doesn't it just oh, say stupid no, as hell? He's actually really good, you guys. <laughs> All right, I, let, I'll be a judge of that, Mister. Every card is card of the, of the dead. <laughs> this, no, he, this, look at this card. Nah, has an immediate effect. nah, he, he don't really deserve all this. He don't deserve all this. Actually, he is really good. Yeah, bro. Who is Vaughn, bro? Why? <laughs> Why this is Vaughn, Vaughn, remember Vaughn, Vaughn everybody. <laughs> this is a three cost four four potentially. This is messed up. Yeah, I don't like their Vaughn's. This like what? What? Listen, Why is he that Listen, really good? I Nefta made the cards. Don't blame me. What? She got a soft spot for you? <laughs> she she what, is, what, is, what do you try to say? Yeah, you can't what? blame me for this. I mean, Nefta what? in uh. in Eden's uh -huh. subconscious made the cards. That's true. Eden's subconscious contributed. Eden, you, you me under the the Eden, I guess you, I guess you, I guess you think Vaughn's pretty strong. You think Vaughn's pretty strong? Huh? Okay. Vaughn is actually no. a really good. Vaughn is actually a meta card. I think. I think Vaughn is would be good in any. Deck. It's a good card, bro. That's why I don't understand why he has all this. Like, why yeah, him? Cool. I'm not okay with that. He, like that. And he's value three. That's crazy. This is bullshit. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> Tempered by the hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, Joe. I, I got a question about this card real quick. Okay. Um, so I see it say the top five cards in any action card you gain a plus three. So does that mean each action no, card no, 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 you no. gain a plus three? It's just if any just, single. That's the first one. Yep. If any of the five, okay. then okay. Have, you get the bonus once. Oh, okay. I was about to say, if that stacks, he's busted. <laughs> no, no, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just make an action Dude, card. That'd be deck. so funny. Uh, like a, like a <laughs> stacked Vaughn taking out Rankers with his plus, his plus like 13 attack. I'm down. I'm down. <laughs> bro, ban we're banning him, bro. We're banning him. <laughs> he's banned. <laughs> yeah, you can't use him in tournaments, bro. That's messed up. We're banning him. He's OU. Yeah. yeah. On the moral high ground alone. <laughs> so you for sure. I think the Vaughn card is actually the top the top five card. <laughs> bro, you've got to stop saying that. <laughs> <laughs> Alongside Orichasa, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, Orish Nuts is okay, but there's a combo, you know? Require needs work. But pulls a workshop the card. Like, Yo, card of the game right here. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, cool. So, so after pulling those cards, I think that's a good cue to cut away to the other group um, who is doing uh, this puzzle currently. Oh, man, I definitely didn't forget. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Let's not, let's not forget. All right. Of course not. Why would you... Any revelations made while I was, uh, while we cut away? Yeah, I mean, I just agree with what Brack was saying. Like, I don't think we can do this. Who all is here? Like, uh, oh, could you, could you clarify what you've, uh, recovered, yeah, yeah. what you've unveiled? We don't have the requisite members, is all I'm saying. Oh, okay. Brag? Huh? You agree, right? Yes. Brag, do you know what you're agreeing with, Sashion? Yeah. What are we talking about? Uh, we don't have the right people here for this puzzle. Okay. How is you passed? I, I passed. <laughs> wow. The the one time I give you some some shit and you 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 act up like this. Hey, yo, where's the? She just called me childish. <laughs> What's up, John? Where's the? Where's the? Like you said, the riddle was in. Yeah, it's in. Yeah. Um... yeah. Um, images, scroll up to last week's images, post. It's yeah. like, uh, oh, I found it, I found it, I found it, I found it, I found it. Yeah. So, which member are we missing? A light bear? Pretty uh, much. Rack wants to test something real okay. quick, though. Okay. Rack okay. wants to get on the south one. You're saying because each of them. Mm. He wants to get on the south one. Alrighty. What happens? Let me pull up the, uh, I want to make sure. Give me a sec. <laughs> give me a sec. I need to go here. Seventy nine. Okay. Uh. Shoot. Sorry. Just give me one moment. Uh, Take your time. Thank you. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Should be here. Okay. Uh, here we go. So, Brack, you step on the south one? Yep. So, when you step on it, you notice that depending on where you stand, it, like, changes the mechanism beneath your feet. So can you be more precise in telling me how you're standing, which direction you're what facing, are you crouching, are you standing up straight? I'm glad you confirmed that, too, because I had a feeling that was going to deal with where I was facing as well. Oh, okay, uh, okay. Let me... I need to find the thing again. Here, like, where is it? Images. It's in images. It's like a little bit up, yeah. There's like a hand pointing on it. Uh, what was the south one? Which direction do I need to be facing? As a, as a sand as a sun is blocked by the fish, staring southward. So I want to face south while I'm standing. Sure. So Brack, as you turn to face south, um, the mechanism clicks. You're not able to tell if it's like the right answer, but you do know that the direction you're facing changed the the way the mechanism responded. It clicks. Okay. It clicks, depending on that. So he's on the south one with his back facing towards the. I think. Um, I, I, puzzle, I right? think. I mean. The... Mm -hmm. Hold on. Yep. 
Whoa. You might need to move north. Oh, hold on. Yeah. So you're saying this is a position puzzle? Mm -hmm. It's the same puzzle from the other room, except where we just control where we're facing. Shion, like, reminds me of the position puzzle on the Linquist at the Linquist Mansion. <laughs> you guys couldn't solve the puzzle. <laughs> She looks back at you like, you were there, if I remember correctly. Brock never said anything. Brock had the answers. No one asked. <laughs> Somehow I think that's right. worse, Brock. <laughs> um, Alright, what, what do you want me to do? Oh, thank you for having this up right here, Joe. Yeah, no problem. Um, I'm trying to remember which one it was. Oh, here it is. Um... To the shining scales. Whoa. Mm -hmm. That will be the, the eastern one. Right one. And yeah. face me. Yeah. Okay. We'll go stand on the eastern plate. Sure. Myself. You shuffle facing the south pedestal. And, so, you know, it's clicking depending on how you move. Again, not confirming anything, but you are choosing. Uh, and a direction, essentially. All right. A little later. What's up? Thought you didn't hear me. I was going to whisper in your ear. Um, go to the western one and face. The stern wave. Huh. I actually think oh, I think I'm you go west the south I, one. I think that you because go think, west, Billios, just Yeah, like, I think you go west, I'm supposed to the be on the setting, south. You're facing... gonna stare south, right? Who, Milios so, you're saying? Yeah, Milios go to the to the west side and stare south. Right. right. So do that do do that for like, I, I I gotta conceptualize this. I'm gonna stare at Milios. Right. Here, feel free to move yourselves. I don't want to. I want you to go where yeah. you think you should go. Oh, okay. Yeah, I see what you're saying, son. So you yeah, face you, me, then. Yeah. Then you face me. Then I go south. I think with my back towards the plane. His back outlined against the stern of the wings. Either way, we would still be missing the light there because. No. Well, the thing is, the so the the southern person. You go north, bro. I think, because like. Me. Well, it, it. Well, I think it's uh, above the table. Above the table. Yeah. Right? Brack mm -hmm. isn't saying this. <laughs> so the first one is giving you the direction and the position, which is right. northern light bear, but it's splitting it up. The second one is giving you outlined against the stern waves. His back turn. It doesn't give you a position, so you don't know where that one goes. That's why I said wave controller goes left he also said because he everything else it, has yeah. a position in its name. So southward yeah. for the fisherman, I and see, eastward I see, I for see. the animal. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. Okay, so the wave control just has to be to the back of the um, light bearer, right? Is that what you're saying? That's what I'm thinking, because the light of the light bearer creates an outline on the stern waves. Back outlined against the stern. So the light bearer should be facing the wave controller and the wave controller position it doesn't really give where you're facing so i'm i take it you could take a neutral stance if you want or you could look at the animal uh the animal tamer or the anima okay but you're saying i would be here you would be in the western one. Oh, the western one yes the light bearer would be in the northern one because the light bearer will have to look at you to shine the light So what you're back. telling me is that we need a light bearer, says Lonnie. I will go I and guess. find Damien. We well, we've been said that since the beginning, Lonnie. I don't know. <laughs> I was trying to help solve the puzzle, but sorry. Well, wait. When we are when we step on these panels, like, is it is there any indication that we're getting that like it's in the correct position? 
does not let you know that you're in the correct position. You just know that the direction is changing the panel beneath you. Okay, well then, yeah, let's go get Damien, because it's not... It's not gonna be help if it's not gonna change until like all four of us activate it at the same time. Then like, there's no point in us sitting here. You know what I mean? Like, almost figuring it out. Okay. Yeah. So Damien, you finish opening the packs. Were they good? Says Hugo. They were marvelous. They were so good, and we still have Hans, Hans's pack. Hey guys, and Lonnie enters the room. Hmm? Can you come? Okay. Can you come with me for a second? We need you for a puzzle. And then she like looks around. Oh. What did you? What happened here? She just sees like masks that have been destroyed, and the crater in the oh. wall, and what? We were, uh... What did you fight? A behemoth? Someone wanted to play with me. And, uh... Huh? It didn't go the way they thought. She just blinks. Anyways, uh, some of us here are not in any position to move around, so I'd hate to move them around, but I'll come with you. And Hugo tags along as well, but Hans and Duke stay behind. Stay safe. Oh, oh, wait. Throw me the pack. Duke, what? Duke, 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 throw me the pack. Duke, Duke, Duke. I don't have a pack. The pack. No, the, the Hans pack. You me, beg. He like he loots Hans's body to find a pack, hey. <laughs> and he tosses it to you. Hey, and uh, the cards seem to be in pristine condition. I'm gonna bring this over to my friends. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So while the rest of you are figuring out the puzzle, Lonnie returns with Damien and Hugo in tow. Hey yo, how can I help? Oh, here by the way. Just throw the uh, pack at whoever's closest to the door. Which is, which is know, but We need you to stand up there. Yeah, if you sure. can. Yeah, of course. No problem. Happy to It'll help. It'll make sense later. And while you're doing it, look away from us. I know it sounds weird, but... Like, uh, what, in the north position? Like, away so from the north the door? Problem. Yeah. Will do. All right. I am... Uh, I don't see that in roll 20, but... I, oh I shoot! Uh, yeah, mine's not switching. I'm bad. My bad. My bad. I did not Here we go. realize. Wait, wait, who's that weird guy him. in the in the front? Well, that's a question for later, I guess. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> oh yeah, don't worry about him right now. <laughs> uh, and then, Ilias, I I still think you guys switch back. Jong, okay. face Damien. Face towards uh, the northern one. Face Damien. Okay, I'll face towards I, Damien. I I disagree. Well, we'll try it, and if it doesn't work, then... If it doesn't work, we can do the other one. Yeah. Yeah, Good we'll to experiment. Do. So, Jong is facing Damien. Correct. Damien is facing north. Correct. Wu, where are you facing? Uh, I mean, I'll face towards where Milios is currently, then. Okay, and then Brack? Brack, let me look at the thing of my Bobby again. Do, 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 do. Brack is facing southward. Okay. Nothing happens. Except the fact that you okay. click into place. So it didn't work. So if I think that if you switch places with Jong, right? Mm -hmm. Like if Brack and Jong switch places right now and Jong uh hmm. Should my, you want me to Stand south with maybe my back facing Damien. Yeah, but like it's so weird because like, or maybe wait, is yeah, Damien, I think you. Or, I think you turn away from him as well. I think you face south. I think that Brack faces your position, and then I face Brack. Okay. So Damien faces north, like looking upwards. You face south. Brack looks south towards Jong, and then I look to the west, yeah, yeah, uh, west towards, yeah, yeah. West towards yeah. Brack. Okay. All right. Oh, uh, sorry. I'll swap you guys for you. Damien, you're facing north. Correct. Wu, you're facing west. 
Brack, you're facing... South, but I thought I was. Oh, I'm sorry. Him. That's my bad. I think I, I think I reversed your decision. Sorry. You're facing uh, South, yeah. and Jong, yeah. you're facing South. Uh, south. The pedestals light up. The room shakes. Nice. nice, nice. As you pass the puzzle. Well done. Yes. I, I raised Better get my some good up. fucking cards from this, bro. You notice. <laughs> that the hallway at the end opens up into three separate hallways, two of them containing treasure chests and one of them a painting. <laughs> Are you happy, Jong? <laughs> well, I don't know. We'll, we'll see what, yeah, okay. Yeah. We'll, we'll see what so that fate has to say. <laughs> nice job, everyone. Well, go collect our reward. All right, you open the- I helped. <laughs> Thanks, Damien, says Lonnie. Hey, no problem. You open the two chests, and they contain two booster packs, both of them character booster packs. And Who's on the cover? Is an Eden booster pack? Oh, yeah. who's on, who's on the you know what? It's a great question. The first booster pack can... Oh, wow. Uh, the first booster pack contains... Ace! It's an Ace booster pack. Let's go! Okay. And okay. the second one is. Oh no! What, what's so funny? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> what is that? Give it to me straight. Yeah, what is that? Give it to me straight. Damn. It's bug, isn't it? <laughs> it's bug. It's bug. It's bug. Oh, it. it. It's a bug. No, it's a no, bug no. booster pack. That means. <laughs> that means no. no. she's a card. Why in the world would you get I mean, it? Who would even put it in the Why is he? You know what? Put Bins it back in the chest. Bins it. Bins it. We don't Bins want it. We don't even want it. We don't even want it. Put it right Wait, back in the Joe, chest. Wait, Joe, who was on the booster pack that I got? <laughs> the, 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 one, the one that... Oh, uh, the, the Hans one. Treasure chest. It's clearly a trash can. Put it right back where we found it, and let's keep going. I'm not, I refuse. Uh, on principle, I'm not All opening right. no bug. <laughs> I'll open no, the yeah. bug pack. That's <laughs> one. The, the Hans one is another Brook pack. Ah, Brook okay. pack. Yeah. Okay. Good looks. Good looks. So we, have so we got two Hans, new packs. Ace. Okay. Yeah. Uh, <sighs> also numbers, boys. Let me, rock, let me rock with this ace pack, bro. Uh, what right. do we roll on? 100? Yep. D That's right. right. Oh, yeah, yeah. D100. So this for, it, woo, for the record, there? this is the ace pack. The ace pack? Okay. I'm going to go with pack. the ace pack. So I just roll like three. I think it's three. Yeah. Three yeah. D100. Okay. <laughs> Sent it to the pits of hell where it belongs, says Jack. Yep. Thanks. <laughs> oh my god. Watch it have like the best cards right. in it though. These are all different. Rolls. All right, what's the first one? Cards today, boys. 46. No dupes today, boys. Oh, six. big whammy, big whammy, big whammy. 46. 46. All right. Oh no. Oh god, no. Oh, he's oh, wait, this might be busted. This might be busted. This might be fucking busted. Oh, he's busted. God, god. Deathwing. <laughs> this man got a Oh my god. What the fuck? It, 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 this 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 is a brick, bro. This is terrible. Like we're never going to use this. Round 10. Can only be played in round 10. Bro, figures he would be a brick. Are you kidding me? Look at this. Yeah, this is like... He costs 10 gold. So yeah, you're not playing this. He's literally like a game ender and like... You gotta do so much setup for it. It's like a Judgment Dragon. This man is a... Is... Is... Yeah. It's not worth. It's not worth at all. Nah, nah. Alright. Alright, 67. Get that off my screen. 67? <laughs> Get that off my screen. 67. No, I shit, I did it again. Alright, it's fine. I'll learn one of these days. Alright. Fucking carry it would be a brick, dude. That's crazy. Oh. What the hell was that? Hey. Okay. Hey. Sacrifice. Death rattle? Rip. No, you can choose to kill him on your turn. Oh. <laughs> oh, if there, well, I, wait, wait, I feel what like there were a few effects that like rely on, on, on death, right? So like, 
because I mean, yeah, you, you, like you could use him as it's, like to save a, you know, if you've got a better card on the field. You it's, know not I mean? bad. It's, it's not, not bad. Yeah. It's not bad. Oh, uh, eighty six is Karibo. Because he, okay, okay, yeah, yeah. But he got high, he has high defense, so good. Yeah, and I mean, like if you toss him in the free slot, like it's a, it's a. Okay, I'm I'm sensing a mixed reception. No, 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 <laughs> Thank I, you. I, 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 I like it. No, I, it just it it hit me. In the <laughs> the timing, you're you're good. <laughs> yep. Okay, eighty six for the hollow. Oh yeah, the hollow. True, true. All right, here comes the hollow. Dun, dun, dun. I'm so scared, bro. All right, please don't. Uh, here it is. Don't drag it in. Oh, and the hell no! yeah, brother. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. What do we got? What do we got? Action card. Starman. Wait, yeah, keep, keep, hold on. Keep oh, right that's pretty good, 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 though. Jerking. That's pretty right. fire, though. That's, that's Is he? Good. Okay. Not... Wait, so yeah, he has fire. to... He's a spear bearer? Is that right? Yep. All action cards get plus one damage what? is what I'm seeing. And yeah, then... yeah. Learning. On arrest, he deals two damage. Uh, okay, to on arrest. Okay. Yeah. Like okay, okay. And that's he he solid. is spear bearer, right? That's confirmed. Yep. Yeah. That's right. Okay. Can you read that then? Full rest, real quick. Okay. Turn okay. Up, I mean, definitely the best card in this in this pack right here for sure. I mean, the, well, the rest. Like, oh yeah, he kind of stupid. Like it's yeah, kind of. Neg I think the rest is kind of neg negligible. Yeah, negligible. We're yeah, not gonna use. Either yeah. Though, yeah, we're definitely not using Kyrie, right. and like Kyrie is not getting you. You could I'm use saying we not using them. This is Hannah's decision. True. <laughs> okay, I, I'm, it's well, true. Okay. We're yeah, making the deck based on what we technically what, oh, what we're the cards the are that we've gathered. It just doesn't make any sense. She'd li yeah. I, play Kyrie. I mean, it would be pretty hype if if Hannah finished off. <laughs> no, no, no. Hannah, yeah, no, 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 no. We've, we've already established the narrative. She has to finish her off with the Eden card. That's that's what has to happen. That's like that's narrative P. But will it? I don't know. We will. We'll, we'll make it work. We make it work. <laughs> that's just what has to happen. It's for the story. All right. Who's, right back. Wait, who's the opening story. the bug pack? Oh, and we have bug a pack. pack. We didn't get a bug pack. We yes, just picked up the garbage. We, we did. Pack. Oh, we have a brook pack, a pack, pack and a bug pack, gentlemen. Who wants I'd like to, to open the bag? Yo, wait, the ace pack, pack had Starman. The that ace is, pack uh, did aw. have Starman. It was a hollow Starman. That's that is true. Fine. Yeah. Aw. That's true. Right. Yeah. What do we got? What do we got? Wait, are you for for bug? For bug, let's go. We're rolling the bug pack. All right, what do we got? It's gonna be the it's gonna be the, it's it's gonna be the best one. Right. It's definitely it can't be. What do we got? What do we got? Four fifty and ninety five. It is. This is the one with Gustang. Four is the first one. <laughs> Four is the first one. <laughs> I'm literally Four. quitting. <laughs> it's actually. All right. No I remembered happen. not to upload a second one. All right. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hell yeah. No, no, no. Oh, no. 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 Oh, look at that. Look Why at that. Why is it so valuable, though? <laughs> I'm going to on that card. That There he is, sick, Chad. Dude. Why is he worse one? He's, he's not, not bold enough. He's not bold enough. Kay, okay, you did an awesome job with the art. Don't listen to anyone. You did. You did, Kay. But he's still not bold enough. He has a nice head of hair. He had a comb over, brother. He's worth four? Can we talk about this? He's got the David Beckham hair. No, he yeah, does not. No, hey, yo, I'm, P I'm not. The effect, though. Plus the effect one gold is fire. Bench, plus one the effect is fire. Plus one suspendium is, is pretty good. And then the location cost is negative one. All right, about location cost, like, fill cards? It's, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. you, you take up that location slot, but that means he's right, not right. going anywhere else, which is sick. And you're getting one gold back for having him on field, so you ain't gotta worry. Yeah, but about you gotta that. spend four just to play him. All right. He's he's okay. yeah, but then he becomes like a. But he's he's uh, driving. Yeah, like he just that's true. That's true. He he he'll kind of want to back. play him. You know what I mean? All right. What's 50. next? Fifty. Fifty. Fifty thrifty. Much better than Kyrie. Fifty. All righty. Fifty is. Oh, yo! Hey. Wait, please, please, 
Toby asked me. Why did she get a bug pack, Joe? <laughs> I didn't. I'm sorry. Yeah, I didn't get the fuck? That. Joe, that's like offensive, bro. You can't do that. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> what the hell? Whoa, whoa. Hold on. Why is she, why is she in the Bartimus? The Bartimus faction. <laughs> she was a Bartimus? Joe. 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 Joe, it's because listen, listen. There was Did a just... there was a moment where Leaf there was no moment. There was worked no with Wu moment, to research the Bartimus potions. Wu, you did this, and what that was enough to put her into the Bartimus <laughs> okay, faction. No, 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 no. Yes, she did that, but it was Damien who assigned her to secretary to take. I understand, but the Bartimus potions were being researched in in affiliation with Leaf. Yes, I, I did oh, give her the okay, I, maybe it wasn't your fault, but. She does have Bartimus affiliation, if that's what you're saying. Okay, can I be honest? Look, can I be I honest? Was... I need I needed a couple more Bartimuses because there's a uh, card that works with Bartimuses, and I was like, Leaf counts. I just remember counts. Billy the okay. Third tried to try to hey. drug her. And what about the the, the other guy, the, the guy that was? Does Bill the Third have a card? Yeah, the fire. Huh? Oh, oh wait, the other yeah, guy. Yeah, yeah, that yeah, was yeah, like, yeah. yeah, that was a different <laughs> guy. He's not a card, yeah. sorry. 95 for the hollow. Yeah, 95. All Come right, on. the hollow is here. Bucks, no whammies. Oh boy. Cross your Bro, this pack has been like a roller coaster, dude. Like, what are we doing? <laughs> All good cards so far. Oh, we got, what is we that? Got, we oh, got, Vixen. Who is that? Hey. Oh, Vixen, well, she okay. Going in my sex Hold on, is she good? Bro, no Let's go. Mune if there's no. Yo? Yeah, she's good. Yeah, she's good, bro. Okay. God, yeah. That's a one one that you just that's dropped. Not, yeah, that's a one one. one. <laughs> that's a freebie. Okay. Yeah. That's not that that's bad. Like I mean, you got on the field like real quick. I'm running three like... victims in my sex <laughs> deck, bro. <laughs> <laughs> like... We're building Eden's deck, but Sun is building his sex deck. Right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. For the future. <laughs> Let me get that real quick. <laughs> Oh uh, damn! All right, can I roll for the what was it? The brook pack. Brook pack. Yep. Brook pack. Right. Give me three D one hundred. Let me roll. Three D one hundred. You got it, baby. Ooh. Ninety-two. Eighty again. Yeah. 80 80 Jerry and Stu. A fifty-four. Or Simon Do. Okay. We got three Simons. Hell yeah! Brother. What's the What's the first one? Ninety-two. Uh, Ninety-two. Ninety-two. Ninety. All righty. The first card is. I'm so, I'm so nervous. <laughs> no! <laughs> yes, no. Yo. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm playing search your deck for an item card draw. Oh. That, that's not bad, but the cost yeah. is too high. It, yeah, it's so expensive. Nah. That's a good effect, but it's so yeah. it's, it's a fine cool. effect, but it's like, like normally what? if it costs if you're at like that stage, like that. The thing is, if you have, yeah, you know? that's, that's what I'm, yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's, uh. Yeah. Um, but it's also right. he has a high he has a high attack and a high defense, so the cost yeah. kind of balances itself out. The art the art is fire. You have that the gold, yeah, yeah. Oh well, yeah, the art is fire. Alright, next one's eighty. Uh another Simon dupe. Hell yeah. Hey, hey, Simon? Hey. Hey. Eden's like, why is there something like Simon? <laughs> yeah. 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 Oh, we're building a uh we're building a Stormblood deck, brother. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Blood story, yeah. Blood story. Yeah. <laughs> I think we. I think you're running two Simons. It's not a bad idea. I think we got to run two Simons, bro. <laughs> All right. Fifty-four, uh, 54. for the hollow. Yeah. Fifty-four for the hollow. For the hollow. Drum roll, please. Here we go. Here we go. Fifty-four. Uh, whoop. My. Whoa. Sorry about oh. that. Oh, oh my God! It's a legendary. <laughs> <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> All right, the hollow. Oh no. Oh. Okay. Hey, hey, okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. What we got? What we got? Too expensive. That's super. But he, uh, he's a beater, though. He's a beater. Like, yeah. Playing of late. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're, that's that's late game. But like, I think the effect is pretty good too. If like you have like a bunch of like ones on the field, you just get that. Yeah, this is like a. Um, yeah, his the deck would need to be set up for him for sure. Cause like, like this is just like you build it with a lot of ones. And, yeah, one of ones, and then you drop yeah. them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh shoot, it's a spear bear too. Just but drops that's not like people. I feel like that's not the deck we we gotta build. No, no, no. Yeah, he's not, yeah. He's not good here. He's not. Nah, good nah. Here. Damn, bro. <laughs> but just remember, the spear bearers they can deal damage and then not take it back, so that could be yep. valuable in the long run. 
Yeah, but he's. And everybody gets goal, initiative. Brother. Yeah, no, I mean, I think I think if we're if we have to at least run forty cars, maybe just tossing him in there isn't a bad idea anyway. Based on what, you know, just like running. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, yeah, right, right, right. Let's put it this way: he's, he'd get on the field before Curia. So. <laughs> yeah, for sure, for sure. All right. Getting, like, Can I get one good pack, bro? I just want like one. Good what, pack, dude? What do you mean? I'm pissed that there I gotta pull so for many... the bug pack to get the cards I want. Bro. You're damn like, right. I am. <laughs> Listen, Damien bro, pulled a holographic Jong pull, in the first booster pack. All right. He sure what did. do I get? I get spit on, bro. That's what's been happening. <laughs> Ridiculous. It's all going to eat. <laughs> See, yeah. <laughs> Can you just let me have this other job? Let me have this moment. That's not mine. Damn. Uh, Shion looks over at you, Jong. Yeah. Like, you're kind of getting into this, aren't you? Jong just looks back at her. We're fucked. <laughs> what do you mean? I, I, look, <laughs> Jong, Jong, look what I got. I got a hollow flex hole. We're going to win this for sure. <laughs> he just looks at the card like. And a hollow you. I'm not trading, by the way, for the hollow you. you, you this is a valuable card that I, I really like. So, first off, the card is for Eden. Second off, nice. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> so, uh, you then notice the uh, painting in front of you. Oh man. We have four jewels among us, like all of us, right? Between all of us. Uh, I think we have more than that. No. I had, four. I had, I had two, two, and then Shion gave me one. Right now, you have a total of four. Wait. That's what I have yeah, in yeah. my notes. So we, oh, we okay, yeah, okay, okay, okay. All right. It right. also so lines up five. with the the scenes you've been witnessing, because I. <clears> yeah, okay. I have so yeah. this is five. Gotcha, gotcha. <clears throat> So, right. do you decide to witness the uh, events? All right, I'm triple jumping into the into the painting. Wahoo! Yeah! Wah! Yahoo! Into dire, dire docks. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, the last thing, and, and by the way, I meant to say this, can I just assume that everything that you all saw, you relay to everybody else so like everybody's caught up to the eden like <clears throat> flashbacks all right mm -hmm. cool yeah 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 so this seems to be taking place immediately following the first time that she met fartland but instead of witnessing a particular scene you start to see like pages of a storybook like flipping and you get to see them grow closer you see singing dancing talking to each other on a hill overlooking with the stars overlooking them and the lights of the two pair estate below meeting farland's family even and eden's time as a member of as an envoy to the two pair family while she's handling the negotiations and the, the transactions all of her free time is spent with farland and eventually, it all lines up and leads up. Stars. <laughs> Chat makes a good point. Uh, lights. Light dots on the top of the Lights thing. in okay, the sky. Keep going. And you hear bells chiming and a small group of people, but mostly just a couple that are there to witness. You can look at my screen. A wedding. Oh. And then the storybook resumes. That happiness, that pure happiness they shared as they shared their vows and continued to spend time together is interrupted as two individuals walk forward. Some, Damien, you start to recognize, and those of you who were there too, the giant woman, Nefta, walking into the scene, 
alongside a man who appears to be Farlin's father, a man named Roberto, arriving to collect Eden after her tasks as an envoy have finished. And they run into Eden and Farlin abruptly exiting a physician's office. And Eden freezes as she sees her mother. And Nefta's eyes glance down at Eden's belly. And she looks back up at Eden and her eyes are like a flame. And those of you who are witnessing this, you can feel the heat like rising in the room and you feel your heart skips a beat as you see the daughter of one of the family heads become enraged and screaming at Eden and in her face, screaming about ruining everything. Their family, shame, the marriage, everything. And as Eden is withstanding this barrage unlike anything she's ever received, she, she yells something. I'm going to have a daughter, mother. A precious daughter for the Hoth family. And Nefta looks shocked. Glancing back down at Eden's belly. And in that moment, Farlin steps between Eden and Nefta, clearly shaking, but stepping between them. And the rage just melts away. And it's as if an idea pops into Nefta's head. She looks at Eden, looks back at the baby. And she just smiles. This might have been the only good thing you've done with your life. Congratulations. And she turns to Roberto. Seems like us in-laws have much to discuss. And she stares back at Eden's belly. And all of you are ejected from the painting. And something that the last thing that you all saw was the way, like, Eden was kind of like holding on to like um, Farland's sleeve and you saw her do that a lot with Victor mm. when they were together as she was not herself. You all find yourselves back outside the painting. Uh, is that That certainly feels like a last painting. Oh, terrible. I... Shion has a lot on her mind that she's not sharing, but she just shakes her head. I didn't know she went through all that. She had a daughter? Uh, Joe. What's up? I would like to roll insight. Uh, into what in particular? Uh, I want to know the... Or I want to get a feeling for what kind of things Xion might have on her mind, but uh, isn't saying. Go ahead. <clears throat> insight. Insight is... 18. So... It's as if seeing these visions of Eden made Shion surprised at something. She seems It seems like Shion didn't expect something, and she's processing it a bit. Okay, okay. But John gives her, like, a yeah. look, like, you know, that he's, like, clocked, like, that reaction, yeah. but he doesn't say anything. Sure, sure. And Hugo's just silent. What we saw was just a fraction of what Eden currently faces. Come on. We need to do more. <clears throat> and then a oh, shard mother. in the painting glitters. <gasps> Can I take the shard? Yeah. 
You now have five shards, and on your way out, the merchant, uh, did the puzzle go well, the riddle? Well, uh, that's going on. You, Joe, we mentioned last episode that yeah. these gems, they might fit together. Yes. I want to see if, if okay. that is the case. Yeah, roll, in, five charts. roll investigation now with yeah, that. Right there, me through this. Two more pieces. Roll, sorry, investigation? You yeah. Uh, 17. Okay, yeah. So with five pieces, you can tell that you're about maybe halfway. Uh, there's still That's a few pieces great. left if you want to complete whatever it is you're putting together. Um, there's still a handful of shards that are missing. Um, oh, that just, does that mean we're only halfway through the paintings? And does it? Yeah. I was gonna say, does it look like, like, is there some kind of recognizable shape that it's starting to form? Hard to say because a couple pieces don't seem to fit directly together. Like maybe there's a piece okay, in the middle. Like they're oddly shaped. Yeah. It's, yeah. It's, oh, okay. It's a millennium puzzle, all right? We just need to solve it, and then we can move on. Yeah, yeah, I was just trying to see if the shape was right. Yeah, it's it's like if you get one or more, one or two more pieces, you'd be able to figure it out. But, like, right now, there could be too many things. You know, it could be too many things. Yes, there's some more paintings we gotta find. We're close, though. There's more we can do. Where haven't we explored? We gotta stay focused. I think there was an area around the ballroom. Okay, let's head there. And uh, follow me, team. Well, uh, uh, the merchant. You are sure you don't want mm? anything from me? Maybe in the future. We'll give me some. Let's let's think. We want to think about it some more. Uh, understandable. Uh, sorry for any inconvenience. Is that fair enough, guys? Yeah, yeah. All right. All right, you start to head to this next area. Um, Eden, I'm going to cut back to you. The walk into the woods with Sigmund continues, and I'm going to say there was a period of silence after the words you had exchanged and such. Mm hmm Eden. Yeah, Papa. I don't know why, but there's some words ringing through my head between you and Nefta. She does yell a lot. <laughs> the walls in that room probably aren't as thick as I thought. You said you cared about your teammates, but didn't trust them. I wondered if we could talk about that for a minute. Okay. After Artlum, what happened between you and your teammates? Um, things were pretty good for couple, you know, a decent amount of floors, and, uh, and she, like, gets really red in the face. You know, I might have had a, you know, um, a little, mm, I might have gotten involved with one of them. One of your teammates? He just smiles. You can tell, like, she is just so, like, she's so embarrassed. Her ears are red, her face is red. <laughs> mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Well, it's, it makes sense. You wanted to move on from the great families and all the problems that they brought. Well, you know, <laughs> I didn't, you know, he might have been a part of the Coon family. He kind of, like, stops. Oh. Oh, oh. I'm so disappointed. I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, 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 no need to be sorry. I mean, he sounds like he must have been a really good guy. He must be a great guy. <laughs> he sure is, Papa. He, yeah, mm hmm. He's something else. I'm, yeah, what? All that aside, like, you can tell she is, like, so flustered. Mm hmm. 
Anyway, so uh, it didn't end up working out. And um, uh, so it just felt like the whole team kind of like pulled away. And, and they all started, you know, the boys were hanging out with each other, you know. And I tried to help. It just didn't seem like they wanted it. So I kept to myself. <laughs> kind of foolishly hoping that, oh, maybe someone will come check in or talk to me. or. But it was only for, you know, team matters, team decisions, team stuff. You know, calls whether they go into a battle or a negotiator. You know, it was just... You know, I wasn't the leader anymore, but, you know, I was still kind of kept in that position. But there was no, like, familial connections made. It was just, Eden, be the leader. Eden, do the job. Eden, make the hard decision. I didn't feel like I was very valued other than to make their stuff easier because they all were doing their own thing. But it kind of felt like if that's all I was good for, then sure, I'll do it. I just didn't want to lose my newfound family again. I just kept going and hoped it would get better and kept going and they just kept pulling apart and didn't seem like anyone was telling the truth anymore and it all got really bad at the workshop. Even the people I was loyal to Bad things happened, Papa. So many bad things. The test administrator from Artland showed up again. Forced me into the same decisions that I had to make, but it was with my own teammates. And I broke down. And when I went to them for help, it was just... Make sure she gets rest. And just talked over me. I even asked one of my teammates who had a weapon that could, he said, take memories away. I, I asked him to take them all away. I hadn't slept in so long. Cause the nightmares were so bad and he said he wouldn't do it. And and then I just tried to turn into, again, what they wanted. They wanted a leader. And even that got shot down. And I went to, to that, I went to Victor for help. That was his name. And he was preoccupied with things. And I just started giving up. It's hard to be in a place where you don't feel wanted, but you know you need them. And we had to go through these battles, and a ranker showed up from Jihad's army and was talking, just dismissed what I was going through, and then I got my ass kicked. <laughs> And one of the rounds, and then I just had to sit there, and I was so beat up. I had to take myself to the infirmary. And just things just continued to fall apart, and I tried to do what I could to keep everything together. I tried to call team meetings and tried to reunite everybody, and, and people were snapping at me, and saying, oh, you know, 
diminishing my pain again, and, and I s snapped it. Stexa so badly, I feel so bad about that. And Icer was there looming over everything. And then we got to the final battle. People were dying. I was absolutely useless against what we were having to fight. And then Icer showed up. And then some of their problem people showed up, and we were left to clean up the mess, and we lost Leaf. And Victor got severely damaged. He got turned into a statue. And all the while, I was trying to keep myself together, because I Leaf was like a daughter. I saw her disappear again. Like Ari. And then Victor was frozen. And my team just left. They just left. Left us in that room. And I'd been abandoned again. And then they came to me with all their problems afterwards, and once I made sure Victor was as safe as he could be. Wu left. I told him to stay, and he was too far gone. Brat couldn't handle the truth. I mean, it showed him the truth, even though we talked about not telling him until he was well. It was just a mess. Damien ended up going to the workshop for tests. I don't know exactly what he went through. He came back very changed. Wu came back changed. And I left. I was so broken. I just had to be by myself. So I climbed for the last seven years by myself. Flitting around from different teams changed my, that's why my hair looks like this. It's since Tai, you know? My hair's all damaged now. So, yeah, I care about them, I do. But I feel like I'm holding on to just... <laughs> my images of them from the second floor when we all got together at first. I think they've changed and I don't know how to handle it. It sounds like... some team problems that... Unfortunately, everyone climbing the tower goes through. You're lucky. The teams I was on when I was climbing, we used each other, threw each other in front of gunfire. Every opportunity we could get to backstab each other, we took. Because our goals were that important. But you and even these others, you don't have that. Your problems exist, sure, but... The fact that it matters so much to you says it all. That you... are so desperate to hold on to what you think you had. Let me ask you this. If you were to... tell them what you just told me, do you think they would know that that's what you're going through because of them? Do you think they are aware that they are doing these things to you? Making you feel the way that you feel? I'm scared to tell them. Why? They didn't handle some things well. And, and I don't want to 
and you you see her like shift into this like very rehearsed persona I'm not allowed to complain if I complain they'll leave she's just looking at the floor the grass I should say If you were to voice a complaint and they were to leave because of it, then what you had wasn't real. And the bond you all shared was glass. If you were to tell them and be honest with them and they were to leave you behind because of it, those are not teammates or friends, and you're better off without them anyway. It took a while, but I did make a few good friends in my climb, and... <laughs> we were different. We wouldn't hesitate to share any and all complaints we had with each other. Sometimes it spawned arguments, Sometimes fights, even. <laughs> he points at his no at his, above his nose. Not in some great battle, but from one of my best friends. Really? We were so mad at each other. <laughs> but by the next day, we had both been honest with each other, confronted the thing that stood between us, even though it was hard. And within a week, we were back to how we'd always been. And I gained a pretty cool new scar. <laughs> all, your scars are, all your scars are cool, Papa. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate that. <laughs> it sounds like your teammates are focused on their own goals and needs to a degree where they don't realize the damage that they do, they're doing to you especially considering what you've already gone through. I truly think the only way to address it is to address it. I mean what I said. If you were to bring this up and they were to leave you behind, you don't deserve, they don't deserve you to begin with. And it's You're going to be hard. is talking again. I am not off. biased. <laughs> yes, you are. They need to know because this tower is cruel and they're dealing with their own problems that sometimes make them blind to the damage and i think all of us can be blind sometimes like you were with stexa some of us need some of us no all of us need somebody there and finding that person, if you have found them, and confirming that they really are there for you, that's more valuable than whatever's at the top of this tower. Let's keep Who talking. Who helps the helpers, right? Hmm? Who helps the helpers, right? That's my girl. And he like ruffles your head. Let's keep walking. Any emotions with this head? Okay. But mm. he pulls out another set of three cards. Oh boy! <laughs> Above Let's the table. <laughs> I'm listening, Papa. What we got? What we got? <laughs> All I'm seeming to help you with is location cards at the moment, but perhaps this can help you in some way. Let me see. There we go. People are making blind jokes in chat. Guys, that's so 2022. All right? Come on. We, we've we evolved. We've grown. All right? Come on now. What are they making blind jokes I don't, don't really believe that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we've grown. Who are you talking about, bro? 
<laughs> right. So he presents you with a number of cards. The first... Yeah. All right, the next. Kinda. Did you drag it in again? Mm, nope. No, bro. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait. Hold a up. God damn. But, yeah. But why Pascal? <laughs> but. but? <laughs> it's it's run by the Yan family. Whoop, sorry. And the last one. Mm. Yeah, go with Pascal. Yeah, Pascal. It's like <laughs> clearly one like of these is way better than that. <laughs> this, is, this is the first I've heard of the the lot of prod archive. I might I might switch up my my deck. We we encountered a yeah. butterscotch. Bro, you you could run like a I mean, butterscotch you know? cost like a would be zero. Zero. Know, like, at the same time. That's just a butterscotch. Like, as far as as Edith's picked up, Pascal is the clear fit. <clears> yeah, I mean that yeah, that's <laughs> But follow your heart. <laughs> now, follow you know, your heart. Or something there. That your, whatever your great. memories. Man, pick your heart. Follow the build. <laughs> follow the build. Like if Taki was there, Wu was there. That Reggie's one would be great, but... No, that's just LB. Uh, yeah, that's yeah, just no. Lapobia. I, I was thinking Lapobia for some strange reason. Oh, place. sorry, sorry. Uh-uh. Yeah. Never mind. Yeah, that's... uh. Okay, <laughs> since we're all in accordance, mm -hmm. um, very quickly off this one, like Eden will look through the cards and sure, like once again, like she'll kind of like look through the ones that, you know, maybe those locations didn't really treat her all that well. Ah, okay. But she'll end up grabbing the Pascal one because she feels like she did do some good there with Jong and his grandfather. You can't fool me. That's not the reason you picked that card. You can't fool me. You would have picked Reggie's. I'm sorry. I was going to say, too, okay, Reggie's okay. would have would have treated you immaculately I'm if joking. you just came to the club. I did, she did. She spent her free time there. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. That's, that's what I thought. I just, you know, when Reggie's the council left speaks, in the dust. I must listen. I I'm know. sorry. All right, Pascal. Talk you shouldn't have put Dan in charge. All right. <laughs> Damn. Dan, can, okay, Dan was the previous <laughs> owner of Reggie's before Taki stormed in and took the title uh -huh. from him. Just yep. to remind any viewers who forget that Dan... And anybody that can get their title taken by Taki with such ease deserves to have it taken. Absolutely. <laughs> Amen, brother. Amen. Damn. Damn. Okay. He smiles, and the two of you continue to walk down the trail. Um, I'm going to cut back to the other group. And I'm assuming you made your way into the hall, to the ballroom, and there is one direction you could enter uh, or continue your 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 adventure from in the ballroom, which is north. So I assume you head north. We're gonna do just a little bit more here. I know it's quite late, but uh, we're 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 almost there. We're almost there. So let me cut to this screen here. Let me copy the group over. On the way, uh, Duke, Hans, and Ryobe um, also follow along. So they end up joining the journey. Uh, and oh, I'm so glad they didn't run off on their own. No, they were they were there. They, oh, come on. They wouldn't do that. They wouldn't do that. Come on now. Uh, they, they, they could. They tag along. Uh, and you end up climbing a bunch of stairs. Now, unlike the other room, which is kind of like a spiral staircase, a small little spiral staircase, this time it's like wide stairs that clearly are leading you to the second floor of the mansion. You are entering a whole new floor of the mansion after exploring the most of the first floor. Okay. Uh, with that said, okay. You wear the big lady, guys. You can strike at any time. <laughs> where, where did she come from? Says Ryobe. The walls. 
Ryo. 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 looking over. <laughs> she's just like, she's in the trees. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. She is, as the kids say, living inside our walls. <laughs> okay. The group enters the second floor, and as you head forward, a path opens to your right. You can go right or straight up. Oh, did we collect? Oh, never mind. I thought there was a gate or something. But what you notice is that it ends in a dead end. Here. It seems as though there's nothing else except to go right. And there's nothing suspicious about this weird mm, dead end? Are you, I'm, it's up to you to determine. Okay, let me do one of those checks. Let's, yeah, I'm going to roll... Mm -hmm. Uh, investigation? Yeah, can I do any lighthouse stuff to, like, help? Yeah, I would oh, s yeah. I would say, um, with your light, using your lighthouses, you can give, like, three people, um, two people advantage with these investigations. So, Jong, right. for example. All right, gang. And Lonnie's gonna roll the other one. Or, unless, Brack, do you want to roll the other one? Gang monsters. Hold up. Um, what am I rolling a one D D twenty for investigation? Ooh, ooh. You get Wait, advantage. So, it, okay, advantage is what we're. Yeah, Damien's lighthouses what? are kind of scanning the room, looking oh, for oh, any. Oh, I need that. oh yeah. it don't matter. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Dang. Rolls the two, rolls the four. <laughs> Oof. I'm gonna take the twenty-one. The twenty-one. So, John, sure. with the help of Damien's Lighthouses, Brack, I'm so sorry, you're able to look around and examine the walls, and even with maybe some of your Shinsu in conjunction with Damien's Lighthouses, um, right here, if we look on roll 20, where I'm pinging, there's something that activates this wall to open up and lead left. There's something. Like, uh, there's something, something can the trigger wall. the wall, but, it, but it, the mechanism is not here. Uh, okay, so it's farther in. Got it. Okay. Now, what, okay. what you also notice is that the northern wall, also the same thing. It seems as though something mm. can open that wall as well. There's some trap doors around here. Okay. Well, that means we can only mm. go one way, right? Let's go right. Keep an eye out for Hold on. Switches. Yeah, keep an eye out for any switches or levers. Sounds good. All right. You head off to the right of the room. And you encounter a small room here. Um, nothing's really here for now. But as you head north, there's somebody blocking the way. It's not the merchant, even though it's the same token. Ooh. He's blocking your path. Go talk to this gentleman. Yeah, what's his problem? <laughs> it's a man with a mask. How dare he? <laughs> Exist in Eden's construct. <laughs> Hello, sir. Would you mind politely getting out of the way? If you would be so kind as to shove off. <laughs> shove off, you bugger. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, we started off strong, guys, but it fell apart at the end. <laughs> I will not let you pass until you answer my questions. Okay. All right. Let maybe we kill him. I, 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 I can I can answer the questions probably. Hopefully, if it's personal, I'd love to answer. These questions, if you answer them, I'll give you something special, and you may pass and obtain that special thing. Hmm. Is the special thing food? But if we, if we kill him, could we just take the special thing off his corpse? A little later, sure. why are you resorting to killing? Let's just talk to the man. L listen. I'm just throwing out all the options. I didn't say we were doing anything. Now, if you want a hint to my questions, you have to give me a card. Oh, what's whoa, your question? You, uh, what? <laughs> yeah, 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 whoa, yeah, yeah, yeah. whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, that's actually, not yeah. real life right now, is it? <laughs> you don't need to talk to your AI card for real. You're <laughs> all in agreement <laughs> right here. Actually, actually, yeah, no. We can pawn off that yeah, we can, card. We can give him some bum cards. You can part ways with that. You're absolutely right. Each of my questions has a time limit. If you ask me for the hint, the timer will pause, and I will give you the hint before the timer resumes. You have 30 seconds. 
for each question. You cannot look at any form of the box chat through your pockets or lighthouses, aka do not look at chat. Please and thank you. I'll turn away. I'll turn off the fourth. I'll look at chat anyway. <laughs> <laughs> oh, poor chat. <laughs> the. <laughs> <clears throat> I will finish. I, you know what? Let me pull up the timer here. I will read off my question, and you will have 30 seconds. The first question is. Oop, time? There we go. What is the name of Lord Signe's husband? What is the full name of Lord Signe's husband? Sigmund Freud. It was a Sigmund Freud, guys. No, I just. Oh, I know this. Freud Sigmund? It was like Bjorn. Bjorn, right? Oh, no, you no, said Sigmund. Wasn't that. Wasn't that. Oh. Um, that wasn't her husband. That's the or, ancestor. Sir yeah, 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 oh. yeah. That was like the great great like grandfather or something. I don't. Also, why would we know his full name? I mean, he just took the linguist name. Hint, young know. man. This clown doesn't remember anything about Sigmund. Hint, give me a card. All right, give him the Kyria you card. You are your goddamn mind. <laughs> what, what was it, y'all? <laughs> <Yes. laughs> the Kyria card's not very good. Yeah, it was. We, oh, we but it's part. a foil, though. It's a collectible. <laughs> it is. Wait, it, no, Kyria wasn't no, the foil. No, no, no. <laughs> nah, he wasn't the foil. Yeah, he oh, wasn't. Starman was the foil. Starman was no. the foil. Yeah, so the card's bad either way. I don't really care. Okay. Okay. Lonnie says, don't we have three Simon cards? Lonnie, 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 <laughs> Lonnie, relax. What are you going to get Simon? I don't have any, I don't even, I've never relax. met the guy. I don't. Come on, Lonnie. <laughs> <laughs> it, it was like, Lonnie, that's just low. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you see this shit, Team Recall? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Okay, we give him, we give him the Kyrie card, yeah? Yeah, give him the Kyrie yeah, card. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, that sucks that we have to get rid of it for this, but I don't remember the name. Then I will give you multiple choice. I will give okay. you multiple choice, and you may choose from the multiple choice. I'll also put the multiple choice in the chat. Once again, no hints from anybody who is also not there. Now, this is what I'm talking about. Wish Red Leader was here. Red Leader would know the answer. That's right. Red Leader wrote everything down. Yeah. <laughs> In her handy dandy notebook. I will give you an extra few seconds. Your multiple choice answers are Hemin in the first, Hemin in the second, or oh, Hemin in the third. Oh my fuck, are you? This isn't a clue. This is a. <laughs> Is it Heaven in the first? Trolling, bro. Let's just kill him. Is it Heaven in the Come second? On, or is it Heaven in the third? Yo, he's not even real, bro. Like, <laughs> like not even no, no, this no, is no. a my, fake person. My, my thing is, like, why would it be Heaven in the first? Because the, they would never get to the second. Or, like, you know what I mean? Like, and then there's no kid named Heaven in. And why would they wait. name the kid Heaven? None of it makes oh, yeah, any that's sense. True. It's a Where trick question, bro. Like, this isn't real. So I think he would be the second. Because after a parent does it the first time, a parent wouldn't want to put their child through that. No, 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 because time. because no. No, but the I think thing, he first. married into the Linquist family. So yeah, like, yeah, I'll, I'll say there's I'll say there's no time. Oh, there's no time. That's true. Because she had a she had like a husband, like a like a first official husband or whatever. But then like he was just remember like we never saw him in the like he was just kind of like tossed aside or whatever or wasn't really. Like, I think that's the first. And then she had, like, some other dude that was kind of, you know, placating. <laughs> final answer. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I think we, my final answer is we got robbed for the Kyrie card for this. <laughs> well, like, for I mean, we would have given it up for one of these questions anyway. So it's just a matter of time. <laughs> What's, uh, what should our answer be? What is uh, B? Him and then the okay, second. I'm, ju I'm saying I think it's the first, personally. But we could totally yeah. not pick that. Is I just don't think you get to the second or the third. Then What's it gonna be? Gatekeepers are like a thing where like if we all guess one. Let's go with the first. Yeah, let's go with the first. Let's go with the first. Is it heaven in the first? Because Signe has the the main bloodline, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, it'd be weird to be married in and be like, all right, you're the second. All right, there you go. 
the merchant yeah, but it come from the previous family the yeah. merchant looks or the the person blocking the way looks at the card my cat meows he stuffs the curie <laughs> card into his satchel you are incorrect it is Heminin the second well, Just god you, damn, you Brain, you song. are immaculate. Woo! <laughs> you actually misheard us. <laughs> we actually I, chose the... Uh, we actually said the first plus one, so that actually equals two. I, I I'm, afraid, was an idiot. I'm, I'm afraid I can't give you one of my treasures. I'm sorry. I can't give you one of my treasures. Okay, next question. Okay, we lose one, but we don't, we're not out. Yeah, that's down fine. That's a boom card. We the really second win. question next is question. this. What is Smile's real name? You have 30 seconds. Oh, Hugo. Well, you know what? this. Oh, yeah. You know uh, this. Don't talk to me about this. Hugh, Hugo. No, 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 I don't know. Hey, you know this. I, I, I do Hugo know the right answer here. to this question, but I don't want to fucking deal with it. Do you guys Big really H. not know? I can tell Just you. Just no, it's not lore, Big H. It's, you know, right? Correct. It's Sarah. It's <sighs> just there. As far as he knows. He, he points. I don't even trust he, that. It's Sarah. All right. There's the answer. Well, that was too easy. You got it right. Congratulations. All right, the question, I'll, right? I'll give you the second right? one of our treasures. It's a shame that someone who knew her was here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's get our let's play our prize. Bro, this construct's about to get <laughs> I'm not even gonna hold you. <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> he literally gave us the question and was like, that shit was too easy. You made up the question. <laughs> that's that's right. We purposely got the first one wrong, so you underestimate us. <laughs> nice. The third and final question. No, what about our prize though? You'll get it yeah, after yeah, this. Okay. Yo. <laughs> The third and final question. Who were the four teammates drafted by Team Recall during the last game of the workshop battle? Oh, uh, Sil Young. Um, what's her name? The maid girl. Um, uh, Sif. Hulk. Sif? Sif. Sif. Simon. Simon and... Uh, I thought it was Hobori. What, what was the... Not him. Yeah, yeah. No, Hobori. And uh, what's his name? Oh, wait, yeah. Well, it was four. Yeah. Was it yeah, yeah, four? Yeah. No, not Dan. It was no, um, no, no. 15 it seconds. Was... Tilly Young, Sif, Herborios, and uh, oh, great. Oh. Yeah. that yeah. loud and proud. Five seconds. You're right, you're that's right, the final right. answer. Hell yeah. That's, that's, lock, that's lock, that in, lock that in. Yeah, 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 lock that in. All right. Five what, seconds. What did we get? No, lock that in. We got Herborios, it. Sif, Folk, and Tilly Young. Yeah, Tilly Young. Congratulations, with five seconds to spare, you answered the question. But should I be surprised when you're the ones who drafted them? Uh, what you doing? Get the attitude, bro. Like, come on. Here's what's gonna happen. All right, so let, no, let, let's get these treasures first. Let's get these treasures real quick. Let's get these treasures real quick. Why is this man so sassy? Like, yeah. no, no, bracket, don't even matter anymore. Let's get these treasures real quick and, and we'll finish this interaction. <laughs> Uh, is it, is it, so a price? And he shows two chests behind him. Yeah, open the chest. Two booster packs. In one chest? No. To oh. Combined. All right. Well, Lonnie says, let, let's open them. Come on. Who's on the cover? Yeah. Who's on the cover? Asking the real questions. Here we are. Uh, let me make sure I have the right dice. The person on the cover is Damien Frog. What? <laughs> it's a me pack. Yo. Okay, unfortunately, that could be a 50 50. Damien oh, Frog. Is it Workshop Damien? It's Workshop it? Damien, yeah. <laughs> yeah, which team oh. is it? Okay, all right. It's all time right. skip, you know, got, second class first. Yeah, you know. we don't, they don't got any PTS times, uh, PTS packs, but that's all. Oh, that, yeah, that's going to be future release, future release. Yeah, yeah. Hey, gaming. Okay, uh, mind if I roll for one of the packs? Yeah, go should be you. Here we go. Pack. Oh, it's your pack. Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. uh, 88, 11, and 5. I think those are all new cards. 88! Oh, man. The 88th what? card oh, is... Yeah, what do we got? What do we got? It got to be a hollow Damien at the end. 
you got. I mean, uh, I mean, do you think I'm number five? I don't know. I think so. Because we were very. Oh, early. Aaron. <laughs> That's what Aaron looked like. That's kind of oh, fitting. That's kind of fitting though, because six. <laughs> Six costs. Uh, though? Let's see. Let's see. At the animation. Holy. He look like a gentile, the criminal, like a villain. My Hero Academia. Oh yeah, yeah. gentle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gentle. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I like, like a... again, if you got Hella Linquist in your deck, like, you know, that's a. Nah, but it, it, it would depend on uh, if we have any other good Linquist for us. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's true. <laughs> so it is six. It's kind of steep. Maybe there has to nah, be like a like a, like a sweeper Linquist card. Like, I don't know, like, That's what I'm saying. If we get like yeah, a ring, <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly, exactly. I feel you. Number <laughs> eleven. <laughs> it was like next, 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 next. <laughs> what if Astrid is, is like Sylvanas? Number eleven is. Oh man, it's bugged. Oh, GG's. Oh, negative one of five. <laughs> I don't know what's more insulting. The fact that he's worth less than Hold one. Hold on. He's played he into your opponent's three zone. Three gold to play. He oh, goes into your opponent's you zone. Know? What is this? No, no. Bro, he doesn't even. No, get it out of here. Get, it, get that off my screen, bro. I don't even want to look at this. Is <laughs> actually, this guy's actually, like literally the He's kind Can of a troll. Can we trade that for the Kyrie yeah. card back? He's actually the opponent. No, he's actually a very good card. Dude. Yeah, he's, he's a troll card because you can just put him on the uh, the opponent's <laughs> side and then they got to good. sacrifice him. They got to give up four coins, four gold. Yeah, is but I don't even want to give like gold. fake bug this, that satisfaction that he was useful. It's also but, fitting no. he's in Damien's pack considering Damien carried him around. That's in true. Yeah, and That's also, true. may I point out he's a part of the Maggie faction. Maggie uh, deck, anybody? Synergy with Orichasa. I don't think anyone was wondering. Uh, no, that. No, how, no, many no, how many cards no, 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 are in this no, no, no. game currently in this expansion? How many cards? Like 99. Uh, 99, 99 cards. character cards. 99 cards. Yeah. And yeah, yeah. you have this many factions, bro. I need to see the full. <laughs> this, this is it. <laughs> this is the, the, the full PDF. <laughs> Number five, the hollow. The, the hollow. Number hollow, five, the hollow. The SSR. Is the SSR. SSR, SSR, SSR. SSR. Oh, no. Oh, my God. That's what I pictured, though, for real. Man, that seems right. Activate two. A hollow right. bill. Uh, uh, that, that ain't bad, though. No, it's pretty good. Especially it's pretty good because the cost is low, too. So it's not. Yeah. It's yeah. Not really good. Dude, but no. To draw a card. Yeah, I mean, he probably would say, be good I'm, in the merchant's deck, but no. That's what I'm saying. No, no but if, you, no, if you're right, no, if you're if you're running a bar to this archetype, yeah, you could run, run, run a couple of them. That's what I mean, but I feel like we're going to have two universal a deck where it's like we need to, you know what I mean? We need to find oh, no. cards that work. All of these cards are useless to us. Yeah. 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 Everyone yeah. 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 scammed, yeah. scammed, bent as hell. Oh, look, it's the, it's the guy who we yelled at on the second floor. <laughs> look. He wanted to be our yeah, teammate, I, and we were like, "As a matter of fact, I think we need a refund." The worst bro. picture he I got from me sweats. I'm it's sorry. Really you, the booster packs are random, but you have another pack, and the Number person, 10. the person who's on, on, the, the, who's on the second pack. Yeah, go ahead. That would Anyone be. Or if you guys want to do one each, the person on the cover is Jong. Oh. Okay. Oh. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> Don gets a roll go. for his pack. What's right, the first yeah, number? Well, you I will tell you in just a <clears throat> second. Bottom. Bottom. 84. 84. 91 and on, 15. 80. All right. 84. Oh, 84. No 84, sir. Oh, come on. No whammies. No. The number. The day, card bro. is. Oh, boy. Hey, hey look. It's that guy. Okay, like, hold on, hold like on, hold 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 soul deal one damage to three. Ooh. Hey, and good AOE, I love it. That's, 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 that's nice for the back pocket, that's nice for the back of the pocket. Uh, all right, all right, all right, all right. So, uh, that's a link for the deck might be yeah, so put in work. Just all right. At us. Oh. All right, what's the next number? Uh, 91. 91. Okay. The next card is... Drum roll. Aww, oh, Taki! I just mentioned there he is. Okay, what do we got? What do we got? Oh, dude, oh but he's a great family, too. 
Yes, he works. Oh, this is good. Ooh, this yeah, is yeah, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A great family. Okay, hold on. And gains yeah, plus, two and uh, plus two fight plus until two. the end of the turn. Uh -huh, so he'll be at a five. All right, all right. Yeah. And what's his position? Fisherman. He's a fisherman. Fisherman. Okay, okay. Okay. This, this, this is just the raw, just the raw initiative for four costs is good without the extra effect either. Also, yeah, I, I just think it's good. And now, right. yeah, and that cross is like right on the line. Too. The it's foil. Changed. What's the number? Uh, uh 15. 15. Oh, man. Oh, the man. Oh, foil man. is. Oh, is it gold or purple? Here we go. Let me know. Okay. Hey. Okay. okay. Hold on. Hold on. Let's read the card here. I mean, she got eight defense. I'm just saying that that's so. Well, she calls six gold, so this ability ain't cracking. Oh, uh, no, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. That's light bearer, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, okay. okay. A foil charity. Oh, that's good. It's really good. And a three. Plus, with the eight defense, she'll be hard to get off the field. And you can negate damage. And, Her and Gabriel have the ranker action that, too. Yeah, uh, you get that second reroll. And Taryn. And Taryn. <laughs> and Longinus. Add them to your deck. The cards have been pulled. You find one, additionally, one other thing in each of the chests. I say Conju. You find a token that features. It's a token that has an image of all of you on it, and it says recall, a recall token. Like the the coin has one of us from Team Recall, or, or it has it all? It features like the group of you, almost like oh, that group okay. photo, you know, maybe not like a real photo, but mm -hmm. just all of you together in one frame. And in the other chest, an Icier token. Mm. And you Don't can see Icier pool. Yeah, you can, you can leave that where well. you found it. With that said, though, we're going to end the episode there. Woo! I wanted no. to I wanted to end with some polls because that was too fun. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Okay. So you're trying to make us gotcha addicts, huh, Joe? Listen, just, like, listen. Well, I already am personally. Can you just please acknowledge that like you have to like give me access to this whole game off? Yeah, so, I'm gonna need so, like, so yeah, 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 we'll talk. Yeah, yeah. I have you'll see. You'll see. Okay. We'll, we'll, we'll right, figure but, this out. Okay, we'll okay, figure this okay. out. If I, I, do, if I do polls, I'll do polls. <laughs> okay, all right. I, I hope everyone watching enjoyed the episode. A little different than usual, but it was a lot of fun. Uh, thank you for being here. Um, once again, the rules to the card game are in the Discord if you want more info on the card game. Um, and then after next week, you'll be able to access all the cards in a Google Drive. So uh, stay tuned for that. Let's hear some, let's see some meta deck building, you know? Let's see what, let's see what you guys can craft. I'm hosting a week one tournament, bro. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Who's hosting Yo, a tournament? Be day one, day one, day one. Day one. Oh, let's man. Well, go. thanks everybody. Leave a like before you go. Stay tuned next Friday. Um, and was there anything else? I don't think so. Have a good rest of your day, everybody. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Peace.